All right, and we are back. We beat Fire Giant somehow. That took like two hours last stream, I think. Pretty sure that was the longest fight yet. But uh, you know, the rest of the game should be it should be super easy from now on. Mm -hmm. I, I foresee no issues. We've got Gods can duo, which are both parryable, so that's that's cool. We've got Malaketh slash Beast Clergyman. Beast Clergyman is not parryable, but Malaketh technically is, but only specifically with an item. But the item does do damage when you parry him. Like, not very much, but it does do damage. So that's probably going to be painful if we actually try to kill him that way. Which we probably will try to kill him that way. But after that, we got Gideon. He's an NPC, but he only casts spells. So I don't know if we could parry him. Well, we can probably retaliate his spells at least. So that's, that's probably fine. Then Godfrey, who is not parryable for some reason. That's pretty lame. So guard counter it is for him. And then Radagon Elden Beast. Which Radagon is parryable, Elden Beast is not. And then there's also, of course, Melania. Who is parryable, so I feel like we should try to kill Melania. So we'll probably, we'll try to squeeze Melania in there as well. Which if we're doing Melania, that means we also have to do Loretta. Which means we also have to do Commander O'Neill. Or, or no, Commander Neil, not O'Neill. The, the other commander. The, the the super spooky one. To get the medallion. I don't remember where the other medallion is, but I don't I don't think it has a boss associated with it. We'll see. We'll figure it out. Alright. For now, let's uh let's go. Shall we jump straight into God's Can Duo? That seems spooky, but, you know, we got to do it. Technically, we don't have to. We could do the, the Gods Can Duo skip, but no, nah, no, nah, we'll do it. We'll do it. Good thing about Faramazula is there should be plenty of smithing stones here. So I'm assuming we'll be able to max out our weapons. I think the final bell bearing for Smithing Stones is here. I'm pretty sure that's what you get for killing God's Can Duo. Okay, this is... Guys. <laughs> okay. They're having a little party. That's fine. <laughs> we got the checkpoint. So yeah, I think we gotta kill God's Can Duo to get our, our Misericord finally fully upgraded. So that'll be nice at least once we once we do do that. I said do do. <laughs> Let's see. Let me get my my standard stuff back on here. Now that we're done with bird tree great shield shenanigans. All right, there we go. There we go. What is that emote, Zatami? What is happening to the Peepo? He's, he's tweaking out over there. <laughs> yeah, another Smithing Stone 8, nice. I believe that gets us to plus 22 on the Misery Core. He, he's jamming out. Oh, okay, if you say so. And as long as he's okay. Yeah, these things are fucking all over the place. Oh, damn. Oh, yeah, we should probably take our bug ears off. We don't really need that anymore, and it literally makes us take more damage. You know, we are playing as as Wolf here. Maybe, maybe it's time to upgrade to... Uh, this isn't really the Tengu mask, but in a way, it's kind of the same thing. You know, I'm going to rock it. We're rocking it for a little bit. Oh, that's not even where I meant to jump. 
but yeah, that works. Bam! Yo, what up, Ashes Law? I am excited to finish this run today. I am very excited. It's been a long one. It's, it's been a longer than expected one. Don't take that out of context. Quite the challenge, I must say. Let's see, any other goodies? Nope. I still have all bosses world record? I believe so, yes. This is the bell bearing, right? Yeah. It's a somber bell bearing. For which one? Seven and eight? Seven and eight. Nice. To go away. Leave me alone. Why would they put this window here if you can't go through? I mean, honestly. They, they couldn't have made it a little smaller so that it's obvious you can't squeeze through. They're just gonna tease you like that. Fine. Bam. This is Raya's robe, yes. We got the waifu drip. Wait, wasn't there a nine? Oh, it's a somber nine. Does not somber nine even exist? I don't know if that's a thing. I think it might just go straight from 8 to the uh, the dragon one. How stupid is that, by the way? You're going to have 1 through 10 for somber and then 1 through 9 for the regular? What the fuck, bro? But uh, infuriating. Infuriating. so stupid. <laughs> That's so stupid, man. Dude, there's a lot of fucking cash just lying around. My god. Should I have the smithing stone number requirements and add smithing stone 9 exist? Yeah, I agree. I agree. Ow. Ow. Go away. Random ass smithing stone six. Okay. There's God's can duo down there. Let's let's scout around as much as we can for get all the goodies. I'm dead. Good. God. Ha! <sighs> Yo, thank you, Aita. We definitely have enough to at least get plus 22. Which I'm assuming the Misericord is, is better at reposting than the Blood Down Fang at this point. I mean, it's gotta be, right? But the entire point of the weapon is to repose. It's not gonna be. <laughs> I bet you it's not gonna be. But we'll see. Excuse me, sir.
This item better be worth it. It's not! Wow! And before some YouTube comment says, Um, actually, the Dragon Wound Grease is one of the best items you can apply to your weapon, and Aggie's an idiot for not realizing how valuable it is. Shut up, man. <laughs> Every time I say literally anything is bad, someone's upset about it. And they're like, Ugh, this guy just doesn't know how to use this properly. And you know what? Maybe they're right, but also it's not that serious, man. <laughs> it's not that serious. Up here? Money. I'll take money. Okay. Alright, let's get back to base. Upgrade Misericord one more time. And then and then it's duos, I guess. I'm a little scared for this one. I don't think this is gonna go very well. <laughs> I do have an ancient dragon stone, yes. I just don't have enough smithing stone eights to uh, to fully upgrade Misericord. But once we kill God's can do it, we get the bell bearing for that, and then we're in business. Plus twenty two to and that's it. That's all we got. Okay. Useless. Yes, yeah, so we can buy sombers up to eight. Wow, great. Mmm, king. Okay. Should I buy some rune arcs? You know what? Sure. Why not? Let's see. God's can duo is parryable, so we're gonna want the critical hits back on. Probably also going to want this back on. Wait, chat. Hold on. Last stream, someone was yelling at me to make my my Misericord lightning damage. Because it does more damage that way. And also, we have the... Oh, that's the Holy Attack one. But we could get the Lightning Attack Scorpion Charm. That's a thing, I'm pretty sure. So, maybe we should get that real quick. Hmm. Yo, Levick, thank you for the five months. Where is that thing? Let's see. Elden Ring... Lightning infuse. You need a thingy for it, right? Don't you need a thingy? I think it's in Lane Delia. 
What is the item called that you need to do it? The whetstone, right. The whetstone. But which one? <laughs> Sanctified wet blade. Here we go. It's in fortified manner in Landell. Yes. Okay. Off we go. Uh, I have no idea which one of these would be the best to go from. Let's just try this one. Where the fuck am I? Do I want to go up that dragon wing? Got a west capital rampart? Okay. Right, it's in the round table hold that's not the round table hold. Mm hmm. Which is there? Not the building right there. Hello? Yeah, this is it. We got his hat. It's stupid looking. <laughs> I don't like. Keep my ugly mask. Thank you very much. Small brain gamer. Thank you for the two months. Oh, dude, we gotta figure out how to get up there. Oh, great. I don't think I ever figured that out in my casual playthrough. Joy. Hold on, guys, I'm exploring. Wow, that's useless. Let's play part 43. That's right, baby. Why is there a grace here? <laughs> is that necessary? Well, well, good. You know, come here. What the fuck was that? Oh my god. Ah, he's too powerful. Bitch. Harrying's so dumb, man. How do, you, how do you tell me that's the wrong timing? It's so stupid. Startup frames are the stupidest thing of all time. Fuck you. All right, that, that, that was our warm-up. We're, we're good to go for God's Can Duo now. Is it this way? Oh, I think this is the way. Yeah. What? Okay, game. Sanctified wet blade. There we go. 
That'll apparently make our stuff do more damage. According to random Twitch user 742. There's a lot of stuff in here. I'm not insulting the fans. No. I'm just saying. People people say a lot of things, okay? And then they get mad at me because I don't listen to them. But, like, you gotta understand that at bare minimum, half the advice I'm given is wrong. <laughs> you know? <laughs> Whatever. Yo, Snag, thank you for the 100 bits. Oh, wait, I'm sorry, Kieran. Thank you for the sub, friend. Yeah, I've been bad about uh, missing subs very frequently lately. I apologize. All right. So we can lightning infuse now, yeah? Yeah. This is better. Are we... Are we sure this is better? What about Keen? What about Keen? Keen, Keen is, is, is better. A little bit, at least, right? What about Holy? Holy's got bigger numbers. And I already have the Holy Scorpion. Do gods can is gods can do resistant to holy damage? I feel like their curse is fucked. So I, if anything, I would expect holy damage to be better against gods can do. Lightning's the highest AR. It's, I mean, sacred literally. Like it, it, it. You could see it has a higher AR right there. Right? Oh, no, it doesn't, because it's plus 20 instead of plus 40. No, you're right. You're right. Mm-hmm. Matt Villain, thank you for the seven months. And Hyper Pigeon, thank you for the sub. Where do I gotta get the lightning scorpion charm? Where where is that thing? It's in Wyndham Catacombs, in a womb sealed by an imp statue. Wow. Oh, I know where that is. That's easy. All right, we'll give it a shot. Let's see what happens. Yo, they give it the 69 beats. Paul. Uh, I want to be at this one. Golden Vow would be better than RKR. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, Foxy Skin. I said that wrong, but thank you for the prime. Alright, right up here. I don't even gotta mess with Mr. Tibia Mariner. Yo, Op. Thank you, sir.
What up, Nick? And Shiki? Okay, if I remember right, the Lightning Scorpion is like near the start of this dungeon. I hope I'm right. I believe you need a censored key, yeah. but we, we, we have one. It's all good. Ow. Is it up here? Already further in than I thought we had to go. <laughs> oh yeah, there it is. Bam. Lightning Scorpion Charm. Perfect. Get me out of here. Sweet. Okay, so we've got a Lightning Misericord plus 22. Ritual Sword Talisman for 10% damage at max HP. Enhanced critical hits. Heal on critical hits. And... Uh, this one. And I think it's 12% extra Lightning attack. Sweet. Let's see what happens. Here we go. So we fought the fat one earlier, so I already know how to Harry him. I feel like the skinny one might be more annoying to parry, but who knows? Oh, I should have switched my flasks back. Whoops. Rocking six ruling flasks. Nice. Can we stop missing each other, please? Okay, that seems unparable. That's fine. Jump attack. To be expected. What? There we go. Oh boy, that's... It's not great. It's definitely not great. He's going to phase transition now. Yep. Gang. Hmm. <laughs> I 
If I remember right, we baited him into using the parryable attack by kind of like sprinting into his face from far away. It didn't work. There we go, there we go. Okay. Oh, yeah, dude. Okay, this should barely not kill. JK, it killed. All right, I mean, that's fine. Okay, can we figure out Mr. Skinny now? He requires multiple parries. Oh, that sucks. You bitch. There we go. Big damage. Decent. I think it's probably better to stick with what we know and just parry Fatty over and over again. That only takes one parry. Tell me, thank you for the gift, sir. Yeah, if I repost Skinny Dude again, he's gonna go phase two. That just sounds like a nightmare. Stay back. Be cool. Thank you. It's insane how reliable baiting that attack out is. He, he does it like every time. Oh, there it is. Fuck. I'm going to try to real nice resolve this one. And of course he doesn't do it. Nice. Classic. I didn't get the RKR boost, but whatever. See that I'm having a fight with my mom. It's actually your mom. How about that? <laughs> it caught him. <laughs> actually, it's your mom.
Did you guys stop holding him? Don't make me. Don't make me. I mean, it doesn't matter, right? It did like two damage. Dude, we were doing so well. We're literally going to first try them. Now, come on now. Come on now. I'm so upset. That would have been incredible. That would have been incredible. Dude, oh. Okay, well, at least the fight is like not that bad. That, that attempt definitely showed that the fight's not that bad. Just gotta be patient. Oh my god, man. Alright. Round two. <laughs> okay, can you stop, like, dying right next to, like, an awkward bit of terrain? Yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Uh-huh. Okay, that's the hardest part about the fight, apparently, is, is getting the repose to register. Oh yeah, my flasks. Thank you. Ten and two, sure. The RKR? Mm, I don't think so. I like how he just chills. What a, what a gentleman. KR in this last one. Oh, 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 of course. Uh -huh. No fair. What the? No fair! What is this true combo bullshit, man? Ah! 
back. There's one down. Now. Dude, is it even worth trying to parry that, dude? I gotta do it twice. And his tells are very unclear. Heck. I'm blowing it! Dude, what the fuck? Come on, man! It's not fair. It's not fair. I literally only failed this fight via the repost not fucking registering. Oh my god. Rose Romancer, thank you for the prime. Why is this the hardest part of the challenge? Honestly. Knight's Resolve is really not helping at all. I need to swap it out for something else. Doesn't last long enough. Every time I try to get it off, it just screws me over. Golden Vow would be a much better option, I think. Actually parried. I feel like probably most of it's just like unclear what the timing is. There we go, there's one. The little spin he does when you parry him for the first time is pretty dope. Not gonna lie. I'll give him that. No oh god. Stop holding hands. Just get away from each other. Heck! Well, there's our first legitimate death. To these guys. That is... Poop. Say that boy, I think about the prime.
Going to be here for a while? I don't think so, honestly, no. This is the one. Okay, bad start. Wow, I, I missed the easiest parry. Transform. Is wrong with this game? Oh my! I'm I'm upset now. I'm I'm getting pretty upset about it. I mean, what did I do wrong? It's so stupid. Jesus, man. Also, can I do my physic? Yeah, I can do lightning physic. There we go. Okay, there's some even more damage. Cool. What up, bottom? It's not the game. You're right. I'm just parrying and then pressing R1 right in their face, and I, that's actually me fucking it up. Uh-huh. Yes, of course. Elder Ring's a flawless video game. All right, do it again. Solid start. Does Okina Mask give a certain buff for the build? Uh, no, it just looks funny. I think, right? Raises dexterity as it lowers focus. Oh. Well, there you go. Obviously, it's raising my dex, which is very important. I mean, it, it, it is helpful. Dex does make me do more damage. True combo. Fireball. <laughs> uh, that's unfortunate. Ah, uh, poop. Yo, little Agnes. Thank you for the prime. What an interesting username you have there. 
And yeah, carrying retaliation would probably work on the uh, on the fireballs, but that's late. We're, we're, we're gonna go for true parries only. Let's just go ahead and drink the physic off the bat for the damage bonus. Luca Trico, thank you for over 100 beats. Big RKR finisher. Nope. I was worried that one wasn't going to work because it was like on a little grade thing. Okay, good. Very good. All right, there's one. Jesus. I do not like the Godskin Apostle. I don't like him one bit. If I die here, it's totally my fault. Okay. Yeah, no, screw the apostle. His parry windows are awful. All of his attacks look the exact same, and half of them aren't parryable. <laughs> Seemingly. Okay, there's the second fatty. Just gotta wait for a third. Do I dare go for the parry on this guy? You know what? Let's do it. I regret this immediately. Okay, well, you can't say we didn't try.
Like two to three left. If I can get a parry with Royal Knights Resolve applied, I think we can get him in two. Just don't accidentally R1, please. For the love of God. Okay, nice. One more, one more, one more. Yes! Yo, let's go, baby. All right, duo down. That really, that wasn't that bad. Godskin Noble is actually a, a very fun boss to parry, I gotta say. I know we struggled with him earlier back in Volcano Manor, but now that I know how to do it, that's a, that's a fun way to fight him. Fuck Apostle, though. He can... No. Don't like that guy. Okay, so we got the somber... Or not the somber. We got the regular bell bearing. Where is it? Smithing Stone bell bearing 4. So we can buy infinite 7 and 8. Which means we can max out the Misericord. So let's go do that immediately. Let's see, I have one Smithing Stone 8. Uh, that means I should need nine more, I think. Yeah. We already got the Ancient Dragon Stone for the plus 25, so we are good. Bam, bam, bam. That's 25, baby. Hell yes. Okay, the damage is maxed. We still need to plus 10 our Blood Hound thing. We can do that right now, too. There's a, there's a somber 10. And uh, in Fairy Missoula, we can get real easy. All right, looking good. Right back to it. Oh, I should probably level. That's a good idea. Let's see, three levels to our name. Hmm. Dex is tempting just for the damage. Bigger's always good. I do think I'm gonna need more endurance to uh, to guard counter some of the later game bosses. Let's go ahead and grab some more endurance. Okay. Yeah, I should probably get Golden Vow. I don't remember where the Golden Vow Ash of War is. What? The fuck? No, Endurance doesn't give us poise. It gives us stamina. And when you block, it drains your stamina. And the bigger enemies will, like, do a shit ton of stamina damage if you block one of their attacks. But we need to be able to stand it to, uh, to guard counter back. Yeah, that too, Sphine. That too. That's a good point. There is a really good Talon. Actual defensive stats. 
Let me see. Yeah, we go from three physical to twenty physical when I when I wield this. You can't see it because my stupid face is in the way, but just trust me, bro. Nice. Could try wearing actual armor. Mm, I don't know about that one. Seems kind of casual to me. We're so beautiful. Wouldn't want to give that up. Fuck this place. Just run! Okay, right behind Mr. Frank here is the Somber 10. Yeah. All right. Fucking poop. Do that whole trip back. I, I I died for nothing just to get this. I don't I don't even need this. I was just curious what it was. Surprisingly well. Totally hitless bird section. Excuse you, Frank. Fine. Keep running. Bye bye. See you later. Okay. So Malakath is right up there. We need to get the item to parry him with them. Because if you're unaware, there there is a special item that you can parry Malaketh with. At least the phase two, the, the, the part that's actually Malaketh. Beast Clergyman, I think, is going to be a whole bunch of guard countering. The phase two 
We can use the Blasphemous Claw to parry his Golden Sword attacks. And it does just a teeny bit of damage. So that's, that's going to be a painful kill. But we're going to at least try to kill him with only that. I think the invasion's back here. You get it from Bernal? Which actually I think is maybe dead because I did Rykard so early without ever interacting with him. So hold up. He might be chilling in the shack dead. He is not. Okay. I didn't pick that up beforehand, right? No, I don't think so. Okay. So yeah, he's, he's in Faramazul. Even if you kill him, he invades you. I see. Interesting. I don't, I don't have to talk to him at all beforehand. Because I've talked to this guy zero times. Something, something, time distorted. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Ernie? You, you out here, brother? Hello? Old Bernardo? Do I gotta open the chest? Ow. Ow, ow. Okay, guys. I can probably parry them, right? Right? Oh my god, if everything didn't have the stupidest delay on it. There we go. I'm gonna die. I am definitely gonna die. One down. Who's next? Bring it on. Correct timing to me. Insane. <laughs> they make the enemies like intentionally fucking shit to parry, dude. Would it be so much to ask to have a single enemy in this game have a, have a smooth attack motion that doesn't fucking pause for half a second halfway through for no reason?
Is it even parryable? Like, how does that not the right timing? Okay, bud. Birdie, where the fuck are you, bro? Just get out of here. Grab my item and leave. Wow. What does it even do? Extends spell effect duration. Whoop de freaking do. Swagmire, thank you for the prawn. Fucking travel, please. Oh. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna see if we can have a chat with him in in Volcano Manor. Maybe that'll get him to show up. Let's see. Burning. You good, bro? So, you killed Rikard. Mm -hmm. I harbor you no ill will. The strong take. Such Can you please just code. give me the thing? Even he was prepared. But any road that we made, we hunted our. And why do you? Why do you even have it? Oh, I am the of all people to have the to blasphemous be. claw thing. Oh, I am the. We refuse. Yeah. Okay. Goodbye. All right, well, hopefully that did it. The strong take. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Of course. How to kill Rikard? Guard counters, baby. Like 30 guard counters <laughs> in a row. That was a bit of a painful one. Oh my god. About doing a dodge roll only run? What you mean like thorn armor? Yes. Yes. Okay, Bernie, please show up this time. It's gonna be real awkward if you don't. Thank you. Surely the one of these parries will work. Okay. What one of them will work? Can you not parry this weapon? If you can't parry this weapon, this is stupid. You could you could parry any melee weapon from a player, right? Surely. The timing's just jank, because of course it is. Yeah, there we go. Don't 
two more. Four more. That attack is some baloney, dude. My god. Don't much care for that. Yeah, you're out. What now, Bernie? Don't you dare cast a healing miracle. Bernie, what are you doing? It's impossible. It's impossible. This time. This time is in the bag. Zero Miss Paris. That one doesn't count. One. I was, I was trying to in intentionally bait him into attacking instead of healing there. I I just happened to miss the penultimate parry there. Mm -hmm. There is there is an idea of some sort there. I promise. Unbelievable. Third time's the show.
Fuck, dude. Jesus. I hate it so much. I hate it. I parry too late every time, because, you know, it, I can't, it, why would you not press the parry button when the attack is landing on you? Why, why would you press the parry button, like, you know, seven frames prior or some shit? Stupid. I'll never get it in my head. Never, ever. Parry from distance. Every time you tell me to, I'm going to refuse to do it even more. How about that? Don't heal. That was a- that was a terrible heal. Also, wow, okay. You healed right in front of me, man. He knows I'm doing a challenge run. He knows, he would have never tried it otherwise. One more. Don't heal, don't heal, don't heal. Fuck. Fuck. Bro, roll! Why does he not roll? Oh my god, I try to sprint away and then I try to roll and he just doesn't. What the fuck? This is ridiculous. Ridiculous. I've died in that exact manner like three times now. Hardest boss, that's true, man. How's this rumbling going? It's, uh, it's something. It's definitely something.
He read me like a book. The jump attack. Oh my god, he's dancing on us. Wow. The BM. Alright, say guard countering. I'm only guard countering things. You can't parry. Because otherwise, obviously, it'd be just way too easy to just guard counter every time. There'd be no point to try to parry. And backstabbing is a backstab a parry or guard counter? No. Every time! <laughs> the scream is pretty funny. We're gonna try to do Millennium. Yeah, 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 yeah. I know. Fucking Bernie? Dude, Bernie's gonna take longer than what's his butt at this point. God's gonna do. Oh my god, dude, I need more stamina so bad. Two missed parries and a Marty out. One. Late every fucking time, bro. Every time. Fuck, I'm out of mana.
Two more. What? You can't tell me that parry was mistimed. You cannot tell me. That doesn't make any sense. Yeah, you're out. One more for the clutch. <gasps> yes! Finally. <laughs> Freaking Bernie, man. My God. What an asshole. All right, we got the Blasphemous Claw. Good. Where is it? Where is it? Am I stupid? Oh, there it is. I was, in fact, stupid. So, Blasphemous Claw. You use it. It's a special parry. You can use it as many times as you want. And it will parry uh, Malekith's gold sword attacks. Only, only the gold sword ones. It does not allow you to repost him but it will do a little damage to him and stun him for a while. So if you were a normal person, you could then follow up with an attack. But of course, we we can't do that, so. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll see. We'll see how this goes. Probably poorly. This is gonna be very painful. Very painful indeed. Hmm, okay. What do we want to put on? Turtle talisman. And guard counters, I guess. We're not going to be able to parry him phase one, I believe. I, I don't think that's possible, so guard counters it is. I wonder if you could carry and retaliate is like rocks. That wouldn't make any sense, but maybe it's possible. Alien, thank you for the prime, and Rachel Skirts, thank you for the prime. Am I ready? I don't know if I'm ready. Let me switch my flask out at least. We don't need the lightning damage anymore. Let's see, Opaline. I think it's gotta be Opaline. The butter, I think of the one, 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 one. I should count my deaths for stuff like this. All right, you can start counting them. Let me know how it goes. Here we go. So I'm, I'm gonna attempt to carry and retaliate his, his rock throws and all that. I highly doubt that works. Yeah, I don't think it works. 
Which means guard counter it is. I'll, I'll try a few more times just in case I mistimed something. Do the big boulder again. Yeah, no. Doesn't work. No surprises there. Guard counter it is. Oh, actually, you know what? I think this is plus nine still. I think I forgot to go back and bust on it. We'll make it work. Bib, thank you for the prawn. This dude does surprisingly little damage to my stamina. Like, I can block this stuff very easily. This phase is not bad at all. <laughs> that second phase, though. Oh boy, that second phase is really gonna be something. Two more. Here we go. Now for the fun parts. Oh boy. So yeah, again, the claw only works on attacks where his sword grow glows yellow. Uh, like that one. I think the worst part is going to be waiting for him to actually use a move that his sword glows yellow for. Him. Okay, this should be one. Yeah! 200 damage, baby! Oh, God. Just got to do that 50 more times. You know, that damage should get a boost from, like, attack power, right? So, like, if I, if I was a full HP, I'd do 10% more damage, maybe? I'm gonna heal just to test that. Cause if so, then we should stack stuff like Golden Bow. Okay, it does not get the bonus. It it's just it's just 205 no matter what. Great. Fantastic news.
Do I even bother with this attempt? I mean, I'm, I'm definitely not going to win this one. Right? I'll get the practice reps in, I guess. Ah, shoot. He did the mix-up. You know, I've done runs with worse damage output than this. This is this is pretty bad. But we can manage it. If only he had more attacks to carry. That's really the only lame part about this. Just having to wait. You cannot parry him regularly enough. This this is the only one. I like the parry timing on this though. The the window seems pretty generous. Or maybe it just doesn't have stupid amounts of startup frames like all the other parries in the game. Keep spamming that, please. What a cool item, man. I like it a lot. I just wish you could do more with it. I mean, if I wasn't playing under my extremely niche circumstances, then uh, it gives you a huge counterattack opportunity. So, like, it, it would normally be more useful than this. In fairness. But, like, why can't I just, pick, like, repost him? Like, come on. Just let me repost. Yeah, for real, dozing. See, I'm not an idiot at pairing. I'm just bad at pairing when it's jank ass fucking startup frames. This is this, this is some Sekiro shit right here. You press the parry button when the attack's about to hit you. Not like half a fucking second before. Not not copium at all, no. I don't know what you mean. Still not dead. Okay, well, I'm out of heals. And he's like halfway ish dead. But you know, for a first attempt, pretty good. Pretty good. Yeah, 
Yeah, that is seriously the freest parry window. I I'm curious on the frame data on that. It seems super generous. Yeah, I was wondering about that, Lazarus. His sword was glowy for like... Just a teeny tiny bit. I don't know if it's parryable or not, though. That, that one right there. I'm gonna guess not. But what if it is? I mean, I guess if there was ever a time to experiment, it would be this attempt. You're not wrong. You know, not bad. First attempt, we, we got him half dead. Not bad at all. Okay. Let me upgrade my blood on thing for phase one. Oh, snap. Plus 10, good. I guess we might as well upgrade the shield a little bit. Why not? Um, okay. I do have a lot of souls. I could pop these to get levels. I don't think I need levels, though. At least not for Malika. Let's do all 12 healing flasks. Okay. Mm -hmm. Physics seems fine. Any other preparations? I don't think so. What's what's the best stuff for me to be wearing? Well, not not, not wearing, but uh, talisman wise. Obviously, we can't get rid of the drip here. Ritual sword talisman does not matter at all. So I guess I should go full defensive stuff for phase two at least. Which I don't really have anything that would help in that regard. Yeah, I mean, I, I feel like we're already wearing <laughs> the best stuff we can for that. Better armor? No, 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 no. Don't be crazy. Alright. Back to it. Yeah, you know, we can ruin Arkin. Honestly, I, I feel pretty confident that we can get it this attempt. Just gotta be patient. I can't believe the, uh, the attack power buffs didn't apply to the damage of that thing. I feel like that stuff applies to all the other tools. And I mean, that's what this is essentially is, right? It's a tool. Weird. Okay, that was uncalled for, dude. I'm gonna, I, I, I'm, I'm healing up, man. No, 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 no. We need, we need to go in as prepared as possible.
Okay. Mm yep, we're good. All right, let's do it. All I gotta do in phase one is not take a shit ton of damage. That, that, that's the only goal here. It's not going well so far. Just wanna save as many heals as possible for, for phase two. My bubble shield, what? <gasps> okay. Oh my god. Like two more. <laughs> And then the fun begins. Oh, okay, just one more. All right, here we go. Got 10 heals to my name, not bad. Definitely workable. I'll go ahead and unequip this just to make menuing easier. Someone do the math. How many of those do we have to even do? It's definitely quite a few. 25? Is that it? Wow, I got a partial parry with the item. Interesting. Okay, well, that was two. It's got to be more than 25. I was going to guess maybe like 40. Three. Oh, 
How do you dodge this attack? Horn! <laughs> Not on great pace with the heals so far, I gotta say. Maybe it is 25. I've already done like noticeable damage to him. Just a little late there. Heck. That's my first outright missed one yet. I wonder if there's a certain range that I should be away from in the like best baits the uh, the attacks I want. Ten, got a partial. Only four heals left, oh boy. Jump off the pillar attacks, nice. Keep doing that, buddy. All right, we're more than halfway there. Class-wise, we're just a bit off pace. I think we started this phase with 10, and we're at four at the halfway point.
15. Or was that 14? 14. Let's go with 14. <laughs> I'd rather underestimate than overestimate. Partial, 15. 10 more? There's no way he dies in 10, right? That looks like more than 10 to me. Well. No, okay. It, it, it checks out. It checks out. If he started at half and we've done 15, then yeah. Sixteen. Seventeen. Oh my god, that attack is fucking brutal. If you're in the wrong place when he chooses to do that, man, you're, you're just kind of boned. Oh god. Eighteen. Nineteen. Twenty five question mark more twenty one. Give me some linear button. Come on. Twenty-two. It's definitely gonna be more than twenty-five. But we're close. Twenty-three. Four. I'm 
gonna say th three more. Four more. Twenty-five. Come on, baby. Twenty-six. Oh yeah, it, it, it's two more. It's two more. Unless he memes me with like one pixel of HP left. That attack. Twenty seven. Come on, baby. One more. One more. We have one heal left. We're in pretty good shape. <gasps> okay, okay. Okay. Oh, the double hit to finish it. GG. Yo. Second try, not bad. That was a really fun fight. I liked that. Whew. All right, man. You can't say that wasn't a little impressive, right? Right. You, you, you can't tell me that that wasn't impressive, at least a little bit. <laughs> I'm not completely terrible at the game. Potterhead, thank you for the 22, 22. And Mute, thank you for the 100 beats. All right. His parry timing is infinitely easier than a regular parry, yes. Yeah, yeah, Earth Tree Burning, whatever. Spongy Wonders, thank you for the prime. Appreciate you. Okay, we're at the end of the game, dude. We got Gideon, Godfrey, Radagon, Elden Beats. And then also Melania. Because, you know, we, we gotta do Melania, right? Like, you, you gotta do Melania. What should we level? A nice 50 vigor. Might not be a bad idea. Twenty eight endurance might not be a bad idea. Let's do 25 endurance and then actually get some more damage. Our damage stats are pretty low. So yeah, I think for Gideon, we can carry in retaliation. I don't think he'll ever actually swing a weapon at us. At least as far as I remember from his fight, he doesn't really melee. So, carrying retaliation, it is. The goal for tonight would be to finish. You know, yeah, I say carrying retaliation, but maybe we should use the Erd Tree, Golden Retaliation. Considering that should do, like, way more damage. It's a little harder to aim, but it's probably fine.
All right. Um, crap. I need mana pots for this, don't I? I definitely do. Oh. <laughs> Back we go. Do like eight and four. That should be plenty. Do I like this or consumables only better? It was crafted only, thank you. Everyone always calls it consumables only. That's underselling it, all right? Mine was harder than that. I'm cooler than that. And uh, I think I probably like crafted only. If only because it's slightly less arbitrary because you can actually beat the game solely with crafted items. Whereas this, it's like, yeah, it's parry only for the shit you can parry, but then also we got to throw in some random fucking shit for the ones you can't. This run's still been cool, though. Hey, what up, Bash Cash? All right. Here we go. Ah, I knew you'd come. Yeah, yeah. To stand before the Elden Ring, to become Elden Lord. What a sad state of affairs. I commend your spirit, but alas, none shall take the throne. Queen Marika has high hopes for us, that we continue to struggle. Are we, are we, are we going? Eternity. Oh, we're going. Okay. Oh, it works. I don't, I don't think you can parry the laser. Holy fuck, Gideon. Okay. Jesus, that did damage. Okay. <laughs> my guy, Gideon. <laughs> my guy, Gideon. Not fucking a rope. I, I would assume you could parry that. I tried to. But those things fly faster than I thought they did. Okay, our damage isn't amazing, but it's not terrible. But the stupid part is that we still take damage, <laughs> even if we retaliate. Okay, you can parry that. That's so weird. That, that feels incorrect. He goes for the heal. Get in, you gotta... You gotta get up here, dude. Oh my god, those are insane! Okay, just do not even attempt to parry those. Jesus. They do so much damage. I didn't want that 41k anyway. Alright, yeah, Gideon officially harder than Malika. 
This confirms it. He rolled it. Ow. Dude, holy oh, fuck, get it, calm down. He's nuts. I don't think I have a magic protection talisman. He's, he's doing big damage, that's for sure. Yeah, nope. Guess I'll die. Jesus, bro. Jesus. But I have a holy damage talisman, don't I? I'm pretty sure I do. Yeah. Slap that on. Okay, that one's actually fully deflectable. That's just if you miss it, you are getting wrecked damage-wise. Here we go, dude. This is the attempt, my god. What a start. The heal? Mm-hmm. Okay, running into the explosion was probably a bad idea. Maybe a slight miscalculation. God, dude, the right card spell is the worst. So tedious. My fellow, you fought well until now. Oh!
Uh, the weirdest of things are challenging in this run. I, I, I was sweating about Malaketh all day, man. Beat him second try, and then old Gideon. It's apparently just a fucking god. I'm going to the bathroom. F fuck you, Gideon. Fuck you. What a jerk. Ralph. It's Ralph. The boy. Say hello, Ralph. You're wiggling. What are you wiggling for? What are you wiggling for? Oh. What a good kitty cat. What a good kitty. You want to go on the tower, Ralph? He says, no, I want to sit right in your lap, Dad. This is where I'm hanging. That's, that's just not going to work, Ralph. I'm sorry. All right, we're going to put the cat out of the room. I'm sorry, Ralph. Say goodbye. Bye. I'm sorry it had to be done. All right, Gidster. Ow. The laser's so inconsistent. Our dog, thank you for the three months, dude.
Like, we do good damage. We just need to not get one hit. Alright, he's gonna heal. Mm-hmm. It just, it's it's like, what the fuck, man? Sometimes you just die. Maybe I shouldn't even try to reflect the beam. I feel like it's, it's one of his more common moves, though. Maybe we'll just dodge it. Rely on the discs and the uh, little magic bolts. Those things. Okay, they fucking wreck as well, you though. Well until Jesus. Go, good damage, good damage. Through the heal. Ow, ow, ow. You fought well until now. Ah. <sighs> okay, mm buddy. something different. There you go. Now the heal. Mm-hmm. Getting there. Well, like five more, four more. Just gotta be patient. Real patient. Yeah, you're out, bitch.
Oh, it didn't work. Got him. Okay. Good. Good, 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 good. Not even you. A man. Yeah, yeah, get in. You're dead. Shut up, dude. Kill. Right. Two required bosses left. Well, or three, I guess, depending on how you count them. Do a little leveling. Health or endurance or damage. I might regret this, but I'm going to go damage. Just because it makes it a nice round 30. All right, Godfrey's not counterable. Or, or, Godfrey is not parryable. So, guard counters it is. I don't think he would have any carrying retaliationable spells or anything either. Yeah, no, I mean, he, do, he doesn't even really have projectiles, I don't think. I feel like Godfrey will probably not be too bad. Horalu, though? Maybe a little spooky. See what happens. Still don't get the whole give him a giant lion only for him to never actually use it in combat kind of thing. I mean, yeah, lore, whatever, but like, still weird. Still pretty weird. Long and hard didst thou fight. Tarnished warrior. Spurned by the grace of gold. Mm-hmm. Be assured <laughs> they the forgot uh -huh. ring resteth close at hand. Okay, yeah, yeah, let's fight. Get it on, Gideon. I miss. Oh boy. How do I hit you without getting hit right back? There we go. Yeah, so we're gonna lose this one. <laughs> I don't think it's gonna be the first try. That's okay.
Yeah, I really could have used some more stamina. Now oh, well. Hard though, please. is phase one and a half soon. Yeah, there it is. Oh boy, okay, you can't block the ground shockwave. That's fun. That's fun. <laughs> oh, man. This might be the hardest part of the fight, honestly. I was worried about Horalu, but if we can't block that, we can't guard counter. I only gotta hit him a couple times, though. One more hit. Oh! I didn't have the stamina. Oh, at least let me get to Horalu so I know what I'm dealing with. Nope. <laughs> okay. Not a bad first attempt. We'll, we'll take it. Not bad at all. Mm. I should maybe swap this out for the Great Shield Talisman. Yeah, let's go ahead and do that. Heck, oh my god. 
Oh, I need to swap my flasks back, too. I have four cerulean flasks for, like, no reason. Chat, my M&Ms are running fairly low here. I, I only have maybe five servings left out of my 62 that we started with. Feels bad. Okay, not bad so far. I'm hoping Horaloo will be easier. <laughs> I don't I don't know the will. But we can hope at least. This dude is really hard to guard counter without getting slapped right back. Yeah. Phase two already, dude? Oh, God. I feel like that's kind of early. Well, phase one and a half more like.
Oh, come on, bud. One more. Okay, okay. Horlu. Hand it in. That will be all. Mm-hmm. Thou didst me good service. Sirosh. He didn't do anything. He literally just chilled there the whole time. I mean, yeah, that's true. If my cat just hung out on my shoulder all day, I'd probably be pretty happy with him, too. I don't think I'd murder him quite like that, but, you know. I've given thee courtesy enough. This dude's so cool. Okay, so the problem with Horalu is that, like, at least half of attacks are grabs, which are not blockable. Not all of them, though. There's, there's got to be something we can work with. Okay, you have to hit me, dude. There we go. That move is like near impossible to dodge, I swear. The the explosion lasts longer than your iframes. I mean, I, I'm, I'm allowed that, right? I, I feel like I'm allowed that. I feel like I earned that. It's, it's a, it's a critical attack. Okay, okay. If we're aggressive enough, we actually get a stagger. That shocks me.
thing. Oh, come on, bruh. Come on. Give me a break, dude. Jesus. You were doing so well. Okay, like two more. Okay, that's like clearly under half, right? I mean, is it not a half health transition? What the heck? Scams. There we go. A 40% transition. Okay. Uh-huh. Yo, Dung Beetle, thank you for the four months. He has like one whole attack that I can actually do something on. Yeah, this is gonna be a bitch. This one might be a little more difficult than anticipated.
I don't think there's anything I could really easily do to get more damage. I mean, I could put on Source Seal, that'll make me do more damage. And also get one shot. Put Ritual Sword Talisman back on, that's some more damage. I don't think those are good ideas, though. I can upgrade the shield a little bit. Actually, I could switch to Jellyfish Shield. Yeah, switch to Jellyfish Shield. Then we can use that to buff some damage. Okay, okay, okay. And then we'll switch Great Shield Talisman for this. All right, that should be better damage. It's it's more slightly. I'm not a full health right now either, so I'm not getting that bonus. Yeah, what was it before? It was 800 something before when the jellyfish shield was active. It's something. It adds up. It's like a hundred more damage when the jellyfish effect was active. Oh, I can actually, okay, with the Great Shield, I can, I can just block the Shockwave. Oh, that's nice. Wait, can I? I, I thought I just did, but now it's not working. Never mind. And now I accidentally buffered an arb here. Fuck. Well, that's okay. And yeah, different um different weapons have different guard counter attacks. Curve Greatsword guard counter is honestly not very good. It's quite slow. But this is a blood plus ten bloodhound thing, you know. So like it does big damage.
nice. Okay, maybe it's just that initial one I can block. Oh no, maybe it's just if I'm point blank I can block it. Okay, okay, okay. We're learning things. You know what? I'm popping the rune arc. I'm feeling it this time. Feeling it. Big damage, dude. 1k a hit. Oh, yeah. Dude, that was such a quick stagger. God damn. Excuse you? I'm sorry? Are you, uh, are you sure? <laughs> are you positive about that one, Gabe? Okay. Okay. If you say so, video game. I'm popping another rune arc. Fuck it.
go. I just need a little more sand limit. Actually, you know what? Wait. I can get a little more stamina. Bam. I, I was basically never getting that max health bonus anyway. Yo, Phoenix. Thank you for the six months, dude. There we go. I was gonna say, he's gotta be close, right? Nice. Okay. I'm coming. Come on, Hora. Need some openings to work with, my guy. That is not an opening. Okay. Oh my god. He has a follow up to like everything he does. I got some damage on him. I'm not sure it's possible to damage him without getting hit. But you know, maybe I have enough heals to just make that work. I wonder if I could block that at point blank. Get a hit in there. only misses when I fucking want him to hit me. Come on, dude. Oh, the low sweep. I'm so boned. So boned. When do I hit him, man? I don't, I don't think I've hit him a single time without getting hit back. What? This is preposterous. This is so rigged. Oh my god. 
There. Oh my god, I hit him without getting hit back. It is possible. Now just do that like five more times. No problem. Oh, if only I had a heal. I got the warming stone. That's not going to do any good, though. It's going to heal him, too. Shoot. Close. Close. I need a lot of healing left for Horolu, so I can just tank through shit. Mm, come. Mm, come. It's definitely winnable, no doubt. I say I need to conserve healing for phase two, and then I just tank like three hits in a row. Solid. Oh my god. Yeah, just go. Yeah. <laughs> let's let's get a do-over on that one, shall we? Actual armor. No, 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 no. You know, I'm going to put my misery cord on to switch to for the crits. That's probably a good idea. I could maybe just try hitting him with the misery cord because it's faster. I imagine it's going to do, like, way less damage, though. Yeah, it's like half. It does hit faster, though. Whether or not that makes a difference, I'm not sure. I think stick to Bloodhound Fang until the crits. Yeah, the dagger might be good for Horlu. I might actually be able to hit him without getting hit back. That's a little more critical damage, I think. Yo, I could have been countering on that the whole time. Wow, that was super good.
One more. Okay, we have, I think, nine heals? That's not bad. Let's see how the dagger does here. I have a feeling it's not really going to make a difference. But we'll see. I'd love to be wrong. Oh, yo, the bubbles. Thank God for the bubble. I didn't get it? Okay, okay, maybe this is the ticket. <laughs> I did get hit there, though. Theory on that attack. I could get a hit off. Oh god. Jesus Christ. I'd have to do the point blank dodge for the explosion though, which is like super fucking hard. Fuck. I thought he was gonna hit me. Well, I'm a cheater. I don't I don't think the dagger's cutting it. Ah, Horaloo. Yo, Z Skater, thank you for the two months, man. Appreciate you, homie. I'm just tanking things. I've lost all sense of strategy in this fight. I, I just hit him and he hits me. <laughs> we see who runs out of HP first. And uh, guess what? It's me. I run out of HP first. It's a monkey brain fight, yeah. I mean, it kind of works though, right? Like, it, it does kind of work. If I just had more stamina for that, man. I just had more stamina for everything, honestly. I 
think that's going to be my best opportunity to hit him, but the dodge afterwards is so difficult. Really broke my stamina? Really? Yeah, okay, I got a free hit there. Could you not miss? Why? Oh my, I was staggered that whole time. That was the worst time to try to buff myself. Fuck, dude, that was going kind of well. Fuck. What a blunder. Like, I'm too mentally tired for this fight. I'm playing so stupidly. It's, it's, it's just, it's too hard to tell when you have an actual safe opportunity to attack. So I just attack and hope to God that he doesn't hit me back. But like, most of the time he hits you back. Yeah, see, like on that, on, on the double axe swing, he doesn't always do the third hit if you block the second hit. But he sometimes does. <laughs> Surprise, he's not parryable, dude, right? He looks like he should be parryable. I'm, I'm pretty upset that he's not. That would have been a much funner way to do it. Usually the, the humanoid enemies are parryable.
fucking poop. Fucking poop. That's not a phase change right there. Come on. Come on. Should I upgrade the jellyfish shield more? So it has slightly better guard. I guess. I mean, it can't hurt. I don't think it'll help a whole lot, but it can't hurt. Oh, no. Hope I need to go buy a somber. I have the Great Shield Talisman, I just don't have it equipped right now. Because these it seemed more important. It didn't seem like it was making that big of a difference. I say as I'm upgrading my shield to do the exact same thing, but you know, what whatever. Um I don't have the somber three and four. Motherfucker. Okay. Well, um, let's let's at least level. Oh yeah, EG exists, that's true. He only has a limited amount of the three and four. Hopefully I have some left. Okay, yeah, we're good. Cool. Imp my shield, thank you. It's got 54 guard boost now, but wow. I think it had 53 before. This will surely make the difference. This is definitely not a waste of my runes. No. Yo, lasers, pachoo, thank you for the prime. Fifty-five guard boost now. Watch out, world. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. You can't get past the tree sentinel the guards lane, Bill. Uh, carry and retaliate his fireballs. Hold up. If we bloodhound step. Then maybe I can, in phase two, when he does the giant AoE explosion, I can guard counter the initial hit and then Bloodhound step out. Maybe. Maybe. Worth a shot. I don't have the stats for fingerprint shield. Also, I don't want to go get it. That's a bitch to get. Hold on, Seth doesn't do damage though, no. It's an evasive move. Okay. Here we go again. Oh, 
great start. Yep, see, I'm, I'm just monkey braining it. I'm just monkey braining, I'm not waiting for an actual safe opportunity. I'm just, I'm just hitting the dude. Demonic Taco, thank you for the prime. Come on, buddy. Bro, what the fuck? Stop! I root arced for this shit. <laughs> Stop being a monkey. No, dude, you're dead. Did that hurt? What the fuck? It's so inconsistent. I don't understand. It was working, where if I was in his face, it wouldn't be damaged him. And now it is doing damage, even though I am in his face. Whatever. Okay. Crap, I hit the wrong button. Hit L2 instead of L1. That's that's the move I want to test. When he does the jumpy, I want to try to quickly hit him with the dagger and then blow down and step out. Problem is I gotta put my shield away to blow down stuff. The shield dashboard takes priority. Go. Oh, 
fuck. <laughs> Uh, press the wrong thing. That is not gonna work, dude. I think I'm just gonna have to fucking dodge it. That's such a hard dodge. Ooh, thank god he missed. Oh, close. Why does he always fucking miss when I'm literally trying to get hit by the attack so that I can counter attack? He's such a dick. Come on, dude. How fucking long does the explosion last? How did that not work? <laughs> what the fuck, man? What do you want from me? It's so close. So close. Runar King again. Come on, man. You were like two hits away. No, you can't jump the final explosion attack. You can roll it. It's just stupid precise timing. I'm pretty sure. Dude, that was an incredible pattern. Okay, straight into phase two. Fuck yes. Got a ton of heals. Oh, 
Yo, we dodged it. It is possible. Too greedy. Trading hits is fine, but we can't do it every time. Nice, dude. Nice. Looking good. What? How is that not a block? Oh, fuck me. What the fuck? How are these not blocks? No, dude, don't let me get fucking memed. I'm getting memes. That's fucking sick, dude. That's so fucking sick. I'm holding block, and it just doesn't block. An incredible stuff. Like, three fucking attacks in a row. Ugh. That was the run, man. Okay. Oh, dude. You couldn't let me get a little bonus damage. Come on, give. Give me a break. Still a pretty good spot. What? 
Good dodge. Okay, we had the bubble on. Just a little too early. Bro, you fuck. That's gonna kill it, yeah. What the fuck? Horalu. Of all things to be the wall. I didn't think he'd be that bad. Usually the guard counter fights are pretty easy. He just has, like, no openings. Nice. Am I going to get trolled again? No. Nice. Okay. Okay. It's about as an ideal start as you can hope for. I, I have all 12 of my flasks. Nice. What? Okay, I'm going to have to disagree with you on that one game, but sure. Whatever. Free hit. That's ah, a little late.
god. Oh my god, the timing is so tight! What?! <laughs> okay, whatever, at least we got the heal off. We're live, we're live. Oh, fucking hell, don't panic. It's impossible to get a fucking hit. That's, that's the only opportunity where you can reliably get a hit. And you gotta get like such a precise dodge after every single one. Yes! Oh my god, one more. This should kill. Yes! Yes! Okay. Oh, that was way harder than expected. All right, we're loot down. We're on the final boss. But first, we gotta go get Melania, right? Like, we we gotta go get Melania. She, she's a parryable boss. That's by far the hardest boss in the game. We, we gotta go do it. So, okay. We'll get back to Radagon. Yo, Silent Music, thank you for the 100 bits. And Bush Lightyear, thank you for the gift sub. Six levels. Hmm. I was definitely hurting for some more endurance there. Vigor's never bad either. Hmm. Strength to wield better shield. I mean, like I need like 40 fucking strength to wield a better shield. It does make my Bloodhound do a lot more damage. Not my Misery Cord though. I could put it into Dex. Actually, Dex gives me more damage in both of my weapons. Hmm. 
I'm gonna go endurance and dex. We'll we'll split it like that. Okay. Okay. So Melania. To get to Melania, we gotta beat Commander Neil in here for one half of the medallion. I don't remember where the other half is. Does anyone remember where the other half is? Oh, Albanorix, that's right. Right, okay, let's go get that first. That's easy. Okie dokie. Yeah, Neil is a parryable boss, so that'll be nice. Yeah, I know there's a new version of the stake skip to Snowfield, but I'd rather just do the normal progression. Wait, fuck, I went the wrong way. I want to go down here. Cool. <laughs> Whoops, I was I was wielding the wrong weapon while riding my horse, so I couldn't double jump. I complained about this last stream, chat, but just, just a reminder. If you have a weapon equipped that you hold over your shoulder like this, you cannot double jump if you walk off a ledge. Watch, I can switch to this one. And we can do it no problem. Switch back to this one. No good. You can't do it. What the fuck? What the fuck, FromSoft? Kenyon, thank you for the sub. And Jay Brian, thank you for the sub as well. Right, let's go this way. Gullible ass chat. What are you? What are, you are you implying? I'm lying about that. It's true, bro. You you can only fuck. <laughs> you can only double jump if you like have a certain weapon equipped. But when you walk off a ledge, you can only do a midair jump if you have the right kind of weapon equipped. I'm I'm not lying. You can you can test this yourself. Put on put on any weapon that you put over your shoulder like this, and it won't let you. Because this game is rigged. Yeah, there's a Zully video on it. Haven't seen the illusory wall video on it. It might not be exclusive to over the shoulder only weapons. It's just, that's generally what it is or what I've noticed it being. I don't think there's any way it's intentional. If it's intentional, that would be dumb as hell.
Because it's not like you can't double jump at all with the heavy weapon. So it's not like it's uh, too heavy to do it or anything. Just a little bug. Now we beat Godfrey, thank God. We're off to Melania now. Well, first we gotta get the medallions. Then we're off to Melania. Okay, I think the dude is over here. I don't have to do a quest line for this, right? I think I can just walk up to him. Maybe he's further up. You. Please no, dear me. Give me the thing. I haven't a clue. No secrets lie with me, not a one. Yeah, 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 just give me the thing. Oh, Someone, me someone's me. trying to murder me, dude. Wait there. Well. <laughs> oh, <hi. laughs> well, don't kill him. Oh, my God. Hold on. Are you parryable? You better be parryable. No, oh, joy. Oh boy. I think he I, I feel like he's technically parable because he has a dagger. But he just never uses it. Okay, you know, we're just gonna try to talk to him again. Wait. Just give me my thing. Oh hi, we're finished. Because my beggar, you must Thank you. If you should meet, then please Okay, kill this idiot, please. Thank you. Deserved. Okay, off to Neil. Oh boy. Everyone's favorite boss. And I wish there was an easy skip to just jump right down there. I'm gonna go all the way around, such a pain. Yeah, thanks for the good luck, Rowan. I didn't find Neil that bad in my casual playthrough. People, people bitch about him a lot. I, I didn't think it was too bad. Same with the gods can do. I think people just have an inherent hatred of multi-boss fights. Which, like, you know, fair. But... Some of them aren't that bad. Gods can do is not that bad. Neil's not that bad. Crystallian Trio, though. Yeah, they can fuck. And yeah, I know there is a skip to get down here. That's, that's why I said an easy skip to get down here, because that skip is hard. 
All right, I'm gonna go to the bathroom real quick. BRB. Ralph's back. He's returned. It's a kitty cat. Yes, I, I washed my hands. So we have a scarlet in here. Oh, that kitty. <laughs> oh, you mean that kitty in the game? Get him, Ralph. Kick his ass. You're better than them. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh, little kitty. Look at him. He's adorable. Yo, Dim Blue, thank you for the prize. Those are disc plates, yes. Okay. Thank you for the two months. Here we go. Just gonna squeeze by you there. Jesus. Yo, what up, Tard? Yeah, we should finish tonight, I think. We're, we're right at the end. We're, we're going for bonus bosses at this point. I'm gonna die. God, dude, the grace is right there. Just get there, please. Okay. You know, I don't even care if I die at this point. No, we did not do Radon, and we probably will continue to not do Radon, because 
He's kind of boring for this challenge anyway. Melania, though. Melania is real shit. Doki. I don't know if Neil's gonna be too bad or not. Let's put our better shield on here. He should be parryable, as well as his goons. Yeah, I think we can do this. I think this will work out fine. I don't even think I have my electricity or lightning talisman on. Yeah, I don't. Get rid of this. All right, come here, Neil. Oh, is he going to be lightning resistant, though? I feel like he might be. I mean, that's decent damage. I, I have a feeling he's lightning resistant considering he's literally like electrified right now. Just a, just a subtle hint. And it might not be the most effective damage side point. Nice, good, good. <laughs> well done. Solid stuff. Alright, I mean, it shouldn't be that bad. We'll just bust out Blood Down Fang. For the, uh, for the Neil Riposte. I, I bet it does a lot more damage. Okay, round two. It's a bit of a worse start. Oh, I don't even have my enhanced criticals talisman. What am I doing? Less damage. Okay. Well, is it recorded? Is them. Ah. Uh, <laughs> okay, buddy. Stop. Let's get this one off. There we go. Now, now we're full parry build. Nice roll. Yeah, that's definitely more damage.
what is that attack? You, you good? Just take a little break there. You know, I get it. He's old. He's got to catch his breath every once in a while. Doesn't, doesn't have the stamina he used to. these attacks I feel like I can't even tell what he's like swinging there's just like I'm moving his staff okay we're getting there Two or three more. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah. Heck. I right, go to Tim. Neil's armor is dope as fuck. I gotta say. I'm a fan of the cape. Now we're not doing all remembrances. But we gotta do Melania. After Melania, we'll we'll finish up. Okay, guys. Sheesh. You see their giant cocks in their armor? Just massive metal bulges. I'm not the only one to notice. Okay, good. Good. They're just, uh, they're, they're very eye-catching, I gotta say really draws your attention right to their penile area intimidation tactic yeah no doubt You and me again, bud.
What what do you mean that wasn't a parry, bro? I disagree. Gentlemen. This double sword dude is real annoying, I gotta say. If you miss the parry. Real annoying. <laughs> Why not a buckler? Uh, with golden parry, the eye frames or the or the parry frames are the same no matter what shield you're using, or so they say. I, it feels the same. There we go. figured out my strategy. He's just only going to use a shield now. Okay, Neil sucks. Oh, freaking. How did this go so well the first couple of times? I'm pretty sure you can only parry his, like, flag spear thingy, not his lightning leg. And he just refuses to fucking use the flag spear thingy. Beginner's luck, run out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's one of my number one complaints about parrying in these games, Sinfir. So there's just no indication of what is even parryable. I mean, you could take some educated guesses, but there's just no guarantee. Like, are, are the double sword attacks not parryable, or did I fuck up the timing? I don't know.
We're doing parries only for enemies that can be parried. Guard counters are just for things that can't be parried. Otherwise, the, the obvious move would just be to use guard counters every fight, because they're, like, strictly better, I would say. I gotta say, Neil has some weird fucking hitboxes. Like, <laughs> some weird fucking hitboxes. Okay, I think our best bet is to try to bait out that, like, behind the shoulder stab over and over again. Take a breather. All right, bud. Take a breather. He got his number now, dude. This attempt's going real well. Just a few more. One more. Bye bye. All right, GG. That was a fun fight when he wasn't spamming random lightning and frost moves. I enjoyed it. Second half of the medallion. Off to the lift. Waste oh, secret medallion. There we go. Secret.
hidden path to the Hailing Tree. So the boss of this place is the Stray Mimic Tier. I don't think you actually have to kill the Stray Mimic Tier to get out of here. But that sounds like an amusing fight, so we're gonna kill him anyway. It's a quick detour. Yeah, that's an invisible pathway there. Sneaky, sneaky. Alright. My exact equal. Bad move. Oh my god, Jesus, the stun lock. Okay, bud. He's too powerful. What the heck? Just parry <laughs> Oh my god. Healing in a duel? Leave me alone. He's cheating. Bro, he is cheating. Bam. Get up. Yeah, see, he healed too. Oh my god. I am I am just fishing for a parry so bad. I'm, I'm that PvP player right now. I got it, though! Bye-bye! Alright, my greatest foe defeated. Good stuff. Good stuff. Oh, it just takes us out here. Okay, that's nice. Okay, we are in the snow theater. I know where I am. JK, no, I don't. I don't have a clue. Did I do Ordinus Skip? I'm playing on current patch, so they, they patched out the easy Ordinus Skip. It's technically still possible, but I've never done it the, uh, the current patch way. So I, th I think we'll just let go the intended route. I think that'll do just fine. Is 
Nice let's play, thank you. I'm very proud of it. We'll do the parry skip, of course. You gotta do the parry skip. There's five decks, don't mind if I do. Okay, how do you even do Ordina casually? It's been a minute. Uh, there's a jail thing you interact with, right? Yeah. All right, I know where these are. This will be no problem. First, we got to go up the ladder here. This took me like 20 minutes to even notice this ladder existed in my casual playthrough. It's pretty damn hidden for something so important, gotta say. All right, there's one. I think we gotta go back up. <laughs> uh, I think. So it's all under control. All under control. See, and then we drop back down. Mm hmm. Now we go up here, of course, and, uh, to die. Just fucking die. Yep! Yep, that's Horda, alright. We're definitely in Ordina. Round two. Okay, I think the ones that we already got stay lit. We can just continue on right back to where we were. They do stay lit. Uh, maybe get the shield out this time. Yeah, that helps a little bit. Ow, God. Wait. Can I? Can, I gotta be able to guard counter, right? Okay. Bye bye. Very good. Three. And 
the fourth, of course, is over yonder. JK, it's not actually over there. Boss. <laughs> this is this is fine. Because of course it's actually over this way Mhm mm Yep and then you're just climbing that tower See chat I told you I knew Whew. What a jump Okay ow 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 Ta-da! A seal was broken. Okay. Yeah, I don't know where the invisible assassin lady was. Leave it on the job. Fine with me. Now we are not doing all remembrances. We're just going to Halig Tree because uh, you gotta do Perry only Melania, right? You gotta. I don't know about required for every playthrough, but at, at least this playthrough, certainly. I didn't do her in my crafting only run. I don't know if people were upset about that or not. Knowing YouTube, they probably were. Get a quick level up. Is that enough? Not quite. Uh, yeah, dicks. All right, chat. It's time for the only speedrun skip in this entire playthrough. We we have to do this one. We are legally obligated to do this skip in the parry only run. Because this is parry skip. Observe. <laughs> Bam. I'm actually shocked we got that so quickly. Very good, very good. Off to Loretto. Who we definitely will be carrying retaliating. Actually, no, probably Erd Tree retaliating. Or, or Golden retaliating. Yeah, whatever. Alright, here we go. Right, not bad damage. Get 
It would help if I actually retaliated the things. There you go. She's getting hard countered right now. I almost feel bad. Ow. Oh wait, I should put on my Holy Talisman. There we go. She's dodging. Okay, Loretta, I see you. I see you. Here we go. Phase two. Oh, I do not have any FP flasks, do I? Uh-oh. Uh, that's a problem. Do I have any shards? Nope. That's a problem. Maybe if I hit every shot, I'll have enough. Ow. Okay, do not try to retaliate the quadruple arrow. Yeah, that's a bad time. Okay. Well, I mean, we were going to run out of FP anyway. It's all good. Mm, I'll just do like 10 and 2. That should be plenty. And look at this. Now the elevator is just already waiting for us. Good old Perry Skip. Let's uh, let's throw this on. Does Blue Charm do anything for us? No. Not with all this equipped, at least. If I took off all that, does Blue Charm do something now? No. Yeah, I'm at 30 equipped load. It's not gonna do shit. How heavy is this thing? 13 and a half? Jesus. Was that necessary, my guy? Rude.
Oh my god, you spells. Hello. Thank you. You know you're a magic horse lady? Are, are you aware of this? Final. No, do not fuck with the arrows. No, 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 no. They do so much damage if you miss. Holy cow. Let me switch my flask. I think I have a holy tier. Yes. Oh. up sell she sell shell seashore I don't Oh, I went for it. I said I wasn't going to go for it. It's so satisfying when you get it right, though. That one, I'm not even going to try. No. No, that is death. Even, even if you do deflect when you're getting hit by the others. It kind of sucks that it can only retaliate like one thing at a time. Fuck. Oof. Gotta dodge through those, not to the side. Dodging to the side does not work out too well on those. It's a high stakes game of ping pong. Mm -hmm. Phantom Ganon vibes. Alright, we got it this time. This is really not too hard of a boss. 
I just keep being a dumbass. What am I doing, man? I'm potatoing. <laughs> Hit the lady, please. There you go. So the problem with parrying her physical attacks is you can't repost uh, horseback enemies. So like I could parry her, but I, that I wouldn't be able to do any damage afterward. <laughs> yeah, that works. Thank you, Loretta. Whoa, 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 whoa. I was inside the horse for a little bit there. Dude, could you stop doing all the spells at once so that it's not safe to parry? Just do one or the other, and I'll hit you back. Okay? Not that one. Fuck that one. Dude, her face too is tough for this. One more hit. Oh, come on. All right. Goodbye, horse lady. Not too bad. Dread, thank you for the sub. Is this Melania and final boss? No. We're nearly done. Can we get sub 24 hour on this one? That'd be nice. Yo, Nick Nicks, thank you for the four months. And DJ Lin, thank you for the five months.
Deserves a serving of M&Ms. You know what? I agree. Okay, this is definitely not a glitch. This is totally legal. Totally legal. Just skip straight to Melania. I mean, you know, why not? I'm gonna run past everything anyway. Might as well just speed the process up here. Bam. <laughs> okay, last level ups before Melania. What do we need? Got three levels. Bigger? Maybe not a bad idea. Dexterity? Never a bad idea. Endurance? For Melania specifically, I don't think it'll matter. Because this is a parry fight. Let's go Vigor. <laughs> Can't go wrong with Vigor. All right, flask-wise, uh, let's just do one FP flask in case I run out of golden parries. Besides that, we should be fine. Physic, we want the lightning damage. Talisman-wise, we want the lightning. Dragon Crest Shield, always good, yep. Ritual Sword Talisman, probably unnecessary. Critical hits up, yes. Green Turtle, honestly, will be useful for dodging Waterfell. So yeah, we'll leave that on. Okie dokie. This is it. I believe it takes three parries to repose to a single time. Hopefully I do decent repose damage. I don't think you can parry waterfall. I don't I don't think that's a thing. What's up, baby? You can parry waterfowl in PvP. All right, well, this is not PvP. I dreamt for so long. Yo, Creed Jade, thank you for six months. Gold, and my blood rotted. Corpse after corpse left in my wake. Next all bosses run a shattered him. It's on the As schedule I awaited, below stream. His return. Heed. My words. I am Melania, Blade of Mikola. 
so I've heard. Oh boy. And I have never known defeat. That was a parry. Okay, I can't parry the foot. Hmm. Okay. Step one's just figuring out what moves are parryable and what are not. I, I imagine most of her sword moves will be parryable. If you're not a potato. Of course. All right, the goal for attempt one is to get one riposte in. I'll, I'll be happy with that. I don't know what's going to happen. Not a parry, bro. What do you mean? Oh my god. I am Melania, Blade of Mikola. Well, okay, there's the first of many. Mm-hmm. At least we got one parry. Wasn't a complete failure. Wow, but <laughs> Okay, that had a bit more of a wind up than I remembered it having. My uh my bad. See that's more like it. <laughs> One. Parry timing is some shit. Yeah, that one's super slow. I feel like that's her easiest parry that she has. Ow. 
there's no way that's not parryable. I'm, I'm just mistiming it. It's a weird timing. Okay, maybe that one's not parryable, though. Which seems stupid. Chat, the shield is fast. It has golden parry on it. It is the same, at least according to chat it is, and it certainly looks the same. Golden Parry is supposed to be even better than Buckler Parry. How was that not though? Like, what the fuck? Let's try the buckler. It, it shouldn't matter. I don't think it matters, but like. Uh, not terrible damage. Not terrible. Oh yeah, she heals every time I fuck it up though, huh? I forgot about that whole part of the Melania fight. Oh, that's gonna suck ass, dude. That is gonna suck ass. I don't have my parry heal on. I don't. Okay, fuck the green turtle. Maybe the buckler is better. I don't know. Not sure if parryable or not. I'm like almost positive that one. Of Just fucked it up. Chat, yeah, okay. Okay. Look, I was the same as you guys. Saying the Buckler Perry was the best. And then all of Twitch chat insisted that Golden Parry or Karen Retaliation would make any shield have the best parry frames and that it no longer mattered. Okay, it ins they insisted. And now you're telling me that actually you want Buckler Parry. Okay, so please understand. I don't know who to fucking believe here, okay? It's impossible to know who is actually intelligent and who is talking out of their ass. There's a spreadsheet in the Discord. Where? Give me the spreadsheet. What, uh, what channel? Yeah, you can link if you find it. 
I'll, I'll try to find two. There it is. Harry and iframe data. Let's see here. The, the, the on-screen chat's blocking a little bit, but it's okay. Buckler, startup, four. Golden parry, four. Carrying retaliation, four. Parry frames, five. Golden parry, carry retaliation, six. Six parry frames? That's it, dude? That's it? I thought it was way more than that. So yeah, look, Garrett, golden golden parry and carry retaliation are straight up better. Oh, this is 30 FPS. Okay, double the values for 60 FPS. Okay, so 12. Yeah, that sounds more right. I still thought it was more than that. I thought it was like 15. So 12 parry frames. Six is in fact better than five, correct. Is there any benefit to Buckler? This has better recovery. This is better, it's got, it's just better across the board. It's better in every way, chat. The table don't lie. You'll go make a spreadsheet that says the buckler has more frames than it to. Uh huh. Mm hmm. I feel like it should be easier with the guard counters. I mean, well, one she'd heal, so maybe not. But even if she was, we do parry only for the parryable bosses. That's, that's how we roll. We'll do Golden Parry on a Buckler, though, just to make you happy. All right, chat. Sound good. not even a clank shit is garbage Hit it earlier than you think you do. That's, that's the trick. You just always got to hit it earlier than you logically should. Because startup frames are stupid. Just keep that in mind. And we can do this. Yeah, see? See? 
Okay, just always hit it early. This is not Sekiro. It's Elden Ring. And pairing in an Elden Ring is stupid. Is that not parryable? That makes no sense to me. There's no way that wasn't close enough to at least get the fucking shield clank sound. Like, what the fuck? That doesn't make any sense. Fire bat. Try Vagabond Clash. It parries faster. Uh huh. Yeah. Mm hmm. Makes sense. Flop them, flop them. Thank you for the slip. I'm a little surprised at how little damage I do with a repost, with the best reposting thing in the game. And a lot of critical hit gear on. Slightly underwhelming. Doesn't make any fucking sense. That doesn't make any fucking sense. With her standing on water, that decreases lightning. That makes literally zero sense at all. We should we should test Blood Out and Fang just to see. If Blood Out and Fang does more than the fucking weapon that's literally designed to critical hit, I'm gonna be pissed. I'm gonna be real disappointed. 
Not exactly surprised, though. Okay, great start. Not sure if Perry will. Chad, is that more or less that those 1983? I don't remember what the other one did. It was less. Okay. Well, that's good at least. Dagger is 2300. Okay. I want to switch the, the damage type on the dagger and see how it does then. Why not try attacking too? Wow, great idea. I, I never thought to attack the boss. It's almost like I'm... <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, you realized. <laughs> Thank you. Did, okay, I'm not convinced that attack fucking works as a parry. It literally just phases straight through every time. Every time. Do I have the thing that lets me switch to Ash of War here? Yes, I do. Um, okay, what's more damage? 225 plus 104, or 193 plus 142. Keen? Is it a little better? Is quality even better? No. What up, banana gems? Sick. Sick. Good attempt. Yo, Zeki, thanks for the 26 months, bud. This is gonna be a bit. This, this is definitely gonna be a bit. Oh boy. Nah, dude. That one's fucked. Am I early or late on that? I can't even fucking tell. It's 1845 is keen. Okay, so the lightning is for sure better. I mean, that makes sense because we have the lightning charm at least.
Like, what the fuck, man? He just didn't even fucking do it that time. Hmm. All right, let me switch it back. I, I don't think that's variable. I am Melania. Blade of <gasps> Oh my god, he has to parry so early there. My god! Why don't I heal? Because I've done literally zero damage to the boss. So why, why should I even bother healing? I heal on successful repose. Chat, I'm begging you all to shut the fuck up about shields. You don't know what you're talking about. I'm begging you. There's just a funky angle there. Plate. 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 This is, this is a plus 25 Misericord. The best critical hit weapon in the game. Late game bosses in this game are just stupidly tanky.
Yo. Are we in a room? Inside. Okay, I can parry that and I I need to learn how to parry it. It was early on that parry. You got to do that one really late. Okay, we're learning things. Now I got to go really early. attempt yet I think very nice she might waterfall though yep, there it is I don't know how to do the point blank dodge. I do have blood on step on my misery cord. I, I should have switched to blood on step. I like trying to parry her attack right after she dashes. That's just hard. Of course, we parried parry this run, these parry, yes. Got a first try, even. It's destiny. Okay, lady. Okay, lady. Blade of Nicola. Ay, ay, ay. Yeah, I mean, the only thing I could think I could maybe put this on, that puts me from 435 to 442. That is not worth the reduction in life. Yeah, no. Of course, if I was smart, I would put on better armor, but... Drip or die, you know. Drip or drown, whatever, man. Close enough. 
early. You gotta parry so weirdly late on that one. All, all the other ones, you gotta parry earlier than you think. Fire damage instead of lightning damage. I'd have to go get the fire scorpion. I don't know if I have the fire whetstone blade either. I mean, you, the water would make the lightning better though, right? Like there's water here. That, that timing feels so wrong. I can't believe that worked. I feel the water valley. Yeah, there it is. a little early. Oh, you gotta parry that one, dude. That move freaks me out every time. 
just go full panic mode. I'm gonna need more flasks of Cerulean Tears. Actually, okay, I assume if I run out of mana for Gold Parry, it just becomes Buckler Parry, right? Which is like only a little worse. I don't have any starlight shards. Starlight shards kind of suck anyway. It'd be good enough for this, because this doesn't take that much FP, but in general, they're kind of bad, in my opinion. They're at least very under underwhelming. good attempt. By far the best one yet. Wait. Oh, fuck. I tried to two-hand my Misericord to start Bloodhound stepping, but I... Pat fingered the jump button instead. It was good. That was a good attempt. Two thirds through phase one. Very solid. Oh, I should have given myself an extra Cerulean. Whoops. Oh well. Carry that man. Stop being afraid of him. Nice. Just a little early, I think. Did 
Definitely late. Dude, the Crimson Dagger is insanely good. The fact that it double procs is so nice. It, uh, it always double procs on bosses. Getting better. Definitely getting better. Yeah, on bosses, it's two instances of damage. Also, my game crashed. F. Am I streaming till I beat the game? We'll see. Let's see, it's 1.42 a.m. We have Melania and the final boss left. I don't think the final boss will be hard. I, I, I'm pretty sure Radagon won't be hard. Elden Beast might be. You can't parry Elden Beast, so it's either going to be a block counter or a retaliation kind of fight. You can't retaliate any of his spells, so it would be a, a bell retaliation. But he has insane holy resistance, so the golden retaliation is going to suck. And post nerf Karen retaliation fucking sucks. So he might be a problem. He might be a serious problem. Let's just worry about old Melania for now, then. start good start great attempts Fuck armor, no. This, this is the look. No, oh, nice. Oh, 
do. HP. Nice. <laughs> okay. Clean. Yeah, I need way more through enters. I'm so bummed. Party wants to try to get more flasks or upgrade them, but also it probably doesn't matter, right? Probably doesn't matter. That's true. We could get the Cerulean uh, dagger to just go infinite. I think the healing is really valuable, though. Yo, Yemo, thank you for the 11 months. Quick little flip. It was rough. Yeah, thanks for the good luck, Swatson. We're definitely getting better, yeah. Definitely getting better. I just wish the timings weren't so unintuitive. Like, it's mostly fine once you know what the timing is, but the timing is just like, it's stupid. It's just a stupid timing. That's, that's literally the only thing that makes it hard. I mean, we've all parried in Sekiro. You can, you can parry in Sekiro so consistently, just because they made the timing better. Not even just the timing window. Just the timing of it. You hit parry when the attack hits you. Or, or like, right before. No startup frames. Early. Late. McDonald, thank you for the 100 beats. Uh, I don't know the exact frame data of DS1 versus DS3 parries, but yes, I'm, I'm going to say that Elden Ring has weird startup times. Yo. Sick. Yo.
Nah, a little early. I thought it was far enough away. Crimson Dagger boosts once on standard enemies, it boosts twice on bosses. NK. You really have to parry as, as soon as she's done dashing there. It's really unintuitive. There's a frost pot of parry. Ripping bathwater. Can you can you tell me this? No. It is not. I think it was a little early. How do I know when to parry her? Literally just trial and error. That's the most unintuitive shit of all time. That one you gotta parry really late on. That one's pretty normal timing. And that one you gotta parry really early on. I am Melania, Blade of Mikola. Gotta be earlier, dude. Oh, it's so frustrating. Why is that one so early? Why? Golden Parry is strictly better than Buckler Parry. It doesn't matter what shield you put it on. It's just always better. By one frame. It's 
Swanson, thanks for 100 bits. I don't think it's a bad idea to require multiple parries through post. I just think startup frames are a bad idea. They'd probably be too easy without the startup frames. But, like, they're just so bad, man. They're just so bad. Zerndiv, thank you for the prime. Fucking 180! <laughs> what the fuck? Hello? <laughs> okay. Hello? What you want to do? Stop falling asleep. Nice. It's Ralph. He's back. Hello, Ralphington. What a little goob. What a goob. Him and Scarlet are starting to get along, yeah? They, they play sometimes. Scar still hisses at him. But she kind of likes him, too. They're, they're, they're getting there. Nice. Ralph is like three and a half months old. Nice.
Uh, we've been doing Melania for what, guys? Like 45 minutes, maybe? I don't even think that long. Maybe half an hour? Yo, thank you for the good luck, Adef. Yeah, this is the bonus round. Well, we haven't done the final boss yet either, but figured we'd do the final boss last, you know. This is definitely going to be the hardest one, though. Without a doubt. trips me up. Zach had thanks for the beats. Okay, what, three more parries? I smell a waterfowl. second there it is oh fuck I keep dodging late on the second one Okay, two more, two more. Yo, phase two, baby! Let's go! What? I'm sorry? <laughs> uh, excuse me? Is this gonna be another situation where, like, I parry her once, and, and then all of a sudden she goes to phase two? What the fuck, dude? Phase two! Wait, I'm sorry. Okay, uh, did they fix the bug where she dies immediately at the start of phase two by just making her not be able to transition from a repost? Is, is that what, is that their solution? Really? Really? This is how they fixed it. Wow, great job, FromSoft. Fantastic stuff.
If I block, she's gonna heal. There's no way she heals enough to not die from a what I'm playing though. This is that's so stupid, man. I'm actually upset. That is so stupid. That's the laziest possible way they could have fixed this. Okay. Okay. I think all the parries are going to be the same here. Just got to watch out for her bullshit effects. Are they the same though? There we go. No, oh, really early. On Millennium. Okay. No, that's just the same stuff. This attack. Fuck everything about this attack. Uh. Oh, yeah, I should use this. She does the parryable attacks way less often. How's that not a parry? Where do you want me to stand? Melania, so that you'll actually swing your sword at me. There you go. Blood down step. Jesus. A little early. A little late. 
hospital late. No! Dude, great attempt, though. Good attempt. By far the best one, yeah. That was the first time we got to phase two. Okay, man. We're, we're getting it soon. We're getting it soon, I think. Let me go to the bathroom. Be right back. Scarlet! Meow! It's pretty baby! Meow! Meow! Good old Scarly! You know what I just realized I don't have on is a uh, Ritual Sword Talisman. 10% more damage at max HP. What the hell do you take off, though? I feel like the only thing I could reasonably take off is Dragon Crest Shield, which seems like a horrible idea. But let's do it. Let's see what happens. Give it a try at least once. That is 10% more damage. That didn't even have the water bonus. I think that'll save us at least one repost in phase one. What the fuck? Are you okay, Melania? I think I like the uh, the ritual sword. We don't take that much more damage. And we can heal up just fine. Mm. 
Okay, never mind. Solid. Yeah, that's 200 more damage if you get her in the water at full HP. Thank you, Golden Berry, for that one. Okay. You know, I don't know about proccing bleed or frost, but I don't I don't think it would happen. Maybe frostbite. I feel like the lightning damage is the way to go though. Cause that's consistent. Yo, silent mute! Thank you for the five gift. Shouldn't have been sprinting away. No, you can't infuse somber weapons. I was gonna say, what if we just put frost on Bloodhound Fang? Actually, I have like a frost thing though, right? Does frost grease? even exist. Should I be using greases? Do you think it's worth it? I feel like it's probably not worth it. Except for maybe the frost grease. Let, let's try blood grease. I doubt we'll proc it. You, you can't even apply it to this weapon. Okay, never mind. Right, because I have lightning on it. I could apply it to this, though. And this already has a bleed effect on it. So may maybe we proc it. Okay, okay. We'll, we'll give it a shot. One shot. I doubt this will proc. Didn't proc in two. Dang. Ah, oh, what the fuck, dude. Dang it, I wish we got three in a row to see if it procced. Okay, I'm trying it one more time. That did more damage, though. I don't think it did. We were doing 2300 a pop with uh, Misery Record. This is like 2100. Yo, Jim Ziang, thank you for the four months.
Oh yeah, 2182. We, we were doing 2300 with the dagger. In the water. Laddie boy. Also, wait, am I only getting one proc of my heal with Blood on Fang? I think I am. The dagger gives two procs. That's weird. I thought it was dependent on the whether or not it was a boss or not. Yeah, there is cold grease, which might be a good idea. But also, we're pretty damn close to beating her as it is. So, like, do I really want to bother? Thank you for the good luck, pineapple. Fuck that move. Three in a row. I'm dead. I am Melania. Rit. It should be Yadra. I already, I already got the lightning misericord though. Damn. Well, it's not that it doesn't sack. It, it's you, you can't put a grease on an elemental weapon. the ritual sword i don't know i don't feel like i'm missing the defense that much like every time i get hit i, I, I gotta heal up once regardless i don't get the ritual bonus that much though i will say that
You cannot parry Waterfell Dance, sadly. And not an option. You can parry the player version of it, but not Melania's. Should have parried that. Yeah, Golden Vow would maybe be a decent idea. The Bloodhound Step has saved my ass quite a few times, though. So I don't know if I want to get rid of that. What? Her sword is so long, man. Shit is so long. I'm always early on that. It's it's such a weird attack. It looks like it should hit you way earlier than it does. Way earlier. I think I'm going to start using the flask phase one. Might as well just try to get to phase two ASAP. It lasts three minutes, so like, if we nuke her, might get some of it in phase two anyway. Let's see how much damage this does. 2800 with the flask, holy shit. I wasn't sure if that counted in the water or not. Okay, 2650 out of water. Yeah, that's super good. Actually, it was early on that one. I'm dead. Unless.
Melania do an attack I can parry, please? Killing me. Hey, good night, mute. Fuck, I hate that attack. Well, okay, that was a buffered one. Did not mean to do that. No, flame great me strength would be worth it. I'm just funny about using buffs like that. I don't know why, to me, like, buffing with talismans and shit does not feel cheap. Like, talismans are flasks. But like using spells to buff for whatever reason seems cheap when it's supposed to be parry only, even though it doesn't make any sense. I just, I don't know, I never use them for, for runs like this. I don't think anyone would care. But for whatever reason, I don't, it just doesn't sit right with me. We have not been on Melania for three hours. There. There's no way. I think it's maybe been like an hour and a half. Should have buried that. I said 45 minutes, 20 minutes ago, okay. I mean, <laughs> my estimate might have been wrong. If anyone actually knows, please say something. Achilles, thank you for the sub. Killed the Reddit 21 hours, so it's been two hours. Has it? It has not felt that long. Input reading, bitch. What the fuck, lady? That's so lame.
That's so lame. God, that's the one that trips me up the most now. I feel like I didn't use to struggle with that one. Dude, Blood Out Step is so good. Oh my god. Yeah, that, that one gets me every time, though. You gotta parry so fast for that. Thought no stream today, and you thought wrong? Yesterday was the day, y'all. Also, yeah, shout outs to Amazing Chess. The YouTube man. Fellow YouTube man, I should say. Yeah, that's great. Got every time with that one. Jesus. Shocked that works. We'll take it. Though. Don't worry, guys. We'll, we'll first try Radagon and Elden Beach. And get under 24 hours still. No, uh, no doubt. No doubt. And yeah, there is Ares. We've, uh, we've got it equipped. I disagree. Oh my god, every time! Blade 
It's always that one. It's always that one. Yeah, what up, big mommy? Ugh. Under, thank you for the sub. Died too. Oh boy. I'm pretty sure I'm I'm parrying too late on it. Pretty sure. It was indeed the double slash. How did you guess? Physic is heal over time and lightning damage. Am I acting or am I really that chill? Wouldn't acting chill and being chill be the same thing? I mean, even if I was fuming on the inside, if I, if I was still keeping my composure on stream, I mean, is that not the same thing as just being actually chill? How is that the opposite? If you're chill, you're chill. Fucking double sledge. Should have buried it. Should have buried it. Whoops. 
Double input. This fight's honestly fun like this. Just hard as balls. If I wasn't so stubborn and went and got Golden Vow and Flame Great My Strength. And you know, actually wore armor. Fuck. This wouldn't be that bad. Yo, Big Jaws Dog. Thank you for the sub. You would let Melania step on you? I have let her step on me. Whether by choice or not. She just kind of does what she wants. She wears the pants in this relationship. It would feel like giving up to go get the buffs and start using the spell buffs now. You know, it, it would it would feel like giving up. It would be smart. But it would be admitting defeats, you know? Feel me? Would I rather be smart or would I rather be stubborn and prideful? You know, I'm not sure. I feel like my head says be smart. But my heart says be prideful and keep doing it the way I'm doing it. How did that not parry? Yo, Master Mate, thank you for uh, the two bullets. Why do I not use a golden or a medium shield? Because Twitch chat would not shut the fuck up about it. Because they were convinced that I need to use a buckler to get best parry frames, even though it does not matter. It honestly doesn't really make a difference. 
much shield I'm using. Like the medium shield would make me take slightly less damage, but like... It doesn't matter. Yo, yep, yep, thank you for the 100 beats. All aboard the scam train. Way. Yep. This is the only phase of the fight. It's ne it's nearly done. Just a few more guys. I think Melania gets hypocritically annoyed by my lifesteal. I mean, I get hypocritically annoyed by her lifesteal, so I'm gonna say yes. Also, fuck Waterfell. I was so close, man. So close. I have never attempted the, the point blank waterfall dodge, no. I, I should probably learn it one of these days. It'd be helpful to know. I am Melania, Blade of Mikla. Okay. It's the Assassin's Crimson Dagger, is what's healing me. I'm I'm ready to win now. We, we've had our fun, Millennium. Let's go ahead and wrap it up. Yeah, this is current patch. Yeah, I pick up my runes every time, even though it's zero, because it literally, it, it just bothers me to see it there. There's no way I'm the only one that does that, right? Like, it's, it's annoying to have it there. It's distracting. It's, it's visual clutter. Fuck. Just check the wiki and learn that Melania is actually the Blade of Mikula. Mm. I don't know about that, man. I mean, anyone can put anything in those wiki pages, you know. You 
bitch. It's literally one attack. One fucking attack is, is gatekeeping me so hard here. Oh my god. Mm, I just bit my tongue. Ow. Oh. <sighs> dancer charm it uh it's not that good I, I already tried it i'd have to i'd have to get fairly naked these bandit boots are heavy what the fuck hold on maybe if i just take off those i mean th those aren't key parts of the look here yeah i i still have oh well i can take that off too That's 20 with 19 damage. Whereas this, it's not as good, but at least it's consistent. I, I, I guess we'll roll with this. We'll try it. Four hundred. Yeah, it's like almost exactly half as much of a damage bonus. But it procs every time instead of just when I'm at full. Probably better. Get it together, man.
Nice. Waterfell? Mm-hmm. You know what I could do is switch this to this when I'm full HP and switch it back when I'm not. That's pretty sneaky. Well, I'm, I'm not full HP anymore. Okay. Oh my god, of course the heal over time ran out right before I got maxed. Of course. Okay, okay, okay. Dusk, thank you for the two bolt. Barely not phase two. Oh wait, right. I need to put this on because this game is stupid. Right. Right. Okay, so if you you cannot repost her and transition to phase two, it literally will not let you on current patch because on the previous patch. If you did that, she would instantly die at the start of phase two. So they fixed it by just making her unable to transition from a repost. Nice job, Fromsoft. Great, great way to fix it. She could never transition. Are you sure? I'm, I'm pretty sure she could and it was bugged. I'm not positive though. Ooh, it's close. Can I maybe fucking get a parry?
What attack do I guard counter her on, though? Like, which one do I actually get an opportunity to hit her back? I feel like probably her, like, long two hit where she jumps in the air. I don't remember what attack I did the first time I got the phase two. Melania. Yeah, this one. She missed. Okay. You're such a penis. Why don't you just die like you're supposed to? Please! It heals her too much, man. She has to get literally one hit on me. This is so dumb. This is so stupid. I, I think I have to repost her again. Because otherwise she's going to heal up. I'm, I'm not, I'm not bonking her, man, no. I'm, I'm doing it the right way. However stupid it is. Just do the jump attack. Please. Not that. You know that's not what I meant, Melania. Do the attack! Oh my god, she's AFK. This is beyond stupid. man I've gotten to a phase two before just like for fuck's sake here 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 here, here. thank you Well, okay, just do this with zero heals. Yeah, no problem. At least we have the Crimson Dagger. Am I even going to have enough mana? Legends. 
flesh be consumed. Well, it doesn't matter now. That's so dumb, man. That's so dumb. It's so dumb. I could get it's really in dagger, yeah. I don't really think my flash situation is like bad necessarily. But I mean I guess that would help. That certainly wouldn't hurt to uh, to have that. And just equip it when we need it. Disagree. Most staggers do extra repose damage, large one, but this one specifically does a lot of extra repose damage. You can see the critical is 140. This is the only weapon in the game with 140 critical. Good try. Parry timing is just stupid in Souls and Elden Ring, Jeff Jeff. The parry timing is like, you gotta do it before the attack instead of when the attack's landed. It's, it's just dumb. It's just dumb. It is pretty small, yeah. It's not that small, though. It's it's like almost twice as big of a timing window as parrying a thrust attack in Sekiro. And I can do that no problem every time. It's just the timing of it is weird and stupid in these games, because they're startup frames. I'm not saying Makiri counter, I'm saying deflecting a thrust attack. That's a seven frame window in Sekiro. Makiri countering it, I think it's 30 frames. Just like deflecting a normal attack.
Can I think of the 200 beats? Stop kicking. Oh my god. Thank you. Now you can deflect any thrust attack and secure them. It's just a tighter window. And there's a select few grabs you can also deflect. You can never deflect a sweep though. Fuck my butt. Oh, I didn't have mana. Fuck me, dude. Uh, let me refill my water. Where is Cerulean Dagger anyway? I guess we might as well get it.
Black Knife, Catacombs, Hidden Boss. I really want to, though. I'd have to go through a whole ass catacomb and then beat a whole ass boss. With parry only. I mean, the boss would get like two shots, but. Still. Morning, Blondie. Yeah, I really don't think Flask is the problem. I agree. time of it. Ha! <sighs> it's like half my death through that attack. That singular attack. It's so fast. It, it's just so fast. You gotta hit parry like immediately. Large one, thank you for the brunt. I, I don't think I even could have fucking deflected that in time. That was sick. That was sick.
town. Was it early? Sorry, I know the talisman switching must be annoying, but it is helpful. What the fuck was that? I, I can't believe I have to do this. That's it's so infuriating. Ah, okay. Well, cool. Cool. I I got a parrier again though. Jesus Christ. It, it's it's definitely a bug. It's definitely a bug. You cannot put her in phase two from a fucking repost. I'm not gonna smack her, man. I haven't come this far just to do something like that. It's not like it's that big of a deal to, uh, to have to get one guard counter on her. It is a total bitch, though. But it's not that big of a deal. I 
did it at Godric? I mean, the game trolled me at Godric. And I, I was trying to go back, okay? I tried to go back and the game wouldn't let me. Switch this back. Well, and now it goes back. Cool. Awesome. Disagree. It's it's like when I put the fucking full HP talisman on, the game just refuses to give parries anymore. It's trolling me. I swear to God. What the fuck? Yeah, that's true. Amazing chess. Thank God they're right next to each other. Not quite low enough. If she didn't heal from a blocked attack, I could kill her here, but no. Also, I never took off my shit that I whoops. I'm way wasting my blue towels or blue dancer charm. Jumpy attack. I fucking hate you. God damn it.
You know, I could hit her with this. This is a faster attack. I, it presumably does enough damage. Oh god. I guess I don't know. Please just do the one attack. Here we go. Yeah, no, I think I need to be Bloodhound Fang for that. She heals a lot. She just never fucking does attacks, dude. She does the fucking parryable ones all the time, phase one, and then she just never does them, phase two. She just stalls and stalls and stalls and stalls. Like, what the fuck? So fucking annoying. Those tilting thing. Ugh. Would I try her in old patch? What difference would that make? She's been the same every patch. At least in single player. Last patch she was bugged. For multiplayer, but... Oh, Just fucking kill me. Just fucking kill me, bro.
blocked. I thought she was doing the other attack. I'm sad, man. I feel like we were right on the edge of beating her, like an hour into attempting. And now it's like, well, like three and a half hours into attempting. Rough. I should maybe save the flask for phase two, I don't know. Yup, yup, thank you for the 100 bits. I actually got Taco Bell last night. Bree and I made a 1 a.m. Taco Bell run. Uh, I agree, phase two of this fight fucking sucks, Ampersand. It's just too much. It's hard enough to get through phase one, and then you just get the exact same fight again, but even more bullshit moves. It's frustrating. What I get? The uh, the classic beef quesarito. Can't be beat.
Okay, two more. Three more. Okay. Oh, for the stupid part. Just waiting her for her to do one attack. One singular attack. That's not the one. That's definitely not the one. Did that heal her too much? It, it definitely might have. Hello? Why are you AFK? It healed her too much, because of course it did. Uh, of course, and now it's gonna be an endless fucking cycle of her healing too much, because she is left with exactly that same amount of health. That's fucking incredible. shitting me. That was such a good attempt, and then I just get trolled. And then I just get trolled. I mean, what are you gonna do?
getting upset at this point, shit. I'm reaching the point where I'm actually upset about it. Oh, I'm sorry it's taking so long, Chad. It's painful. You like my fashion? Thank you. And you know, don't bad mouth uh, other creators, please. I don't know if you're kidding or not. But even so. Unnecessary. Oh, Fucking hell. Blade of Nicola. Fucking poop. Eminem journey is almost finished. Getting close. Chat, I was at the dentist today. Getting, uh, getting my teeth examined, right? And the nurse is like getting me all checked in and whatnot. I'm like settled in my, in my examination room. And she asks what I do. And I tell her I'm a YouTuber and a, and a Twitch streamer. <sighs> and she like, did not believe that I made money that way. She was like, so are you coming here from work? And I'm like, no, I work at night. She's like, oh, okay, what are you doing? I said, I'm a YouTuber and, and stream on Twitch. And at first she didn't know what Twitch was. I was like, it's a, it's a live streaming platform. So basically I play video games and then make videos of them on YouTube. And then she got quiet for like 30 seconds. And then, and then she's like, so you get paid for that? I'm like, I told you it was my job. <laughs> I, I, I didn't say that, but I was just like, yeah, I get paid for that. So I, I feel like she didn't believe me and she just like thought that I was a fucking bum living in my mom's basement or something. Just freeloading. <laughs> she didn't ask a single other question about it after that. And then the actual dentist came in and he asked the exact same thing. 
And I decided to just say, I'm a YouTuber, instead of explain the whole Twitch thing. And he was like, oh, cool, that's nice. That must be the dream job, right? And I'm like, yeah, thank you. It is, as a matter of fact, Mr. Dentist. At least he was cool about it. You ever just like get hit immediately in an attempt and you just instantaneously give up? Like, why the fuck should I even continue? <laughs> the dream job of parrying Melania for four hours, yeah. That's right. Do you think these, like, mega streamers are, like, still out there getting fucking, like, weird-ass looks and, and, and judgment from people whenever they, they tell a, a random person that they stream for a living? It's like, these people are literally making millions a month, and then, like, they, they tell people that they stream, and I, I guarantee people are still like, what the fuck? This fucking loser. <laughs> no, I mean, may maybe, yeah, maybe if you live in an actual, you know, popular, cool area, and not Indiana, where people understand. I mean, this nurse was like, she was not that old. She, she was like 30s at most. Okay, I'm, 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 I, need to, I need to shut up about Miss Bitch at the fucking dentist office, okay? I need, I need to focus up here. I'm sorry, she's not a bitch. She just doesn't understand my gamer career. <laughs> that was uncalled for. That was uncalled for. <laughs> Not Harvard, thank you for the two months.
Uh, don't worry about it, Chet. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. Okay. Okay. We live in a society.
blade. Come on, man. Hmm. I'm not giving up Raya's address. I'm not doing it. What up, Fabio? Thanks, bud. Okay. 
society. What the fuck? Okay, what was that? Get it together, get it together. Blade of oh, Nicola. fucking shit. I'm losing it. I'm losing it.
This is definitely taking longer than fire joint. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. I mean, I would have liked to keep it under 24 hours. That apparently was not in the cards though. Just kill my dumb ass. It's not over till it's over, you know. We can't we can't just cut it off. Oh my god, it's 4.20 a.m. Oh my god. No, no, fucking dumbass fucking game. That's not what I want to fucking do. You know what the worst part is, chat? I'm gonna spend five hours or however long this ends up taking doing this. And then someone's gonna roll up here with 99 vigor, 99 strength, 99 dex, full armor, all buffs, and say, LOL, I did this in half an hour. I can't believe how bad Ag is. As if it's remotely the same thing. Sorry, streamer, I saw Ongball do this in a video, and he did it first try in the video. Seems like you're just kind of bad, bro.
What the fuck, dude? What the actual fuck? I'm sorry, you dodged 89 degrees away from from Melania. You, you, you had to be straight 90. I'm sorry, 180, I should say. Oops. I'm, I'm losing the ability to do math. Picture Melania as the nurse. Uh-huh. Show her a thing or two.
baloney. Baloney! Baloney! Fucking hell. It takes so long. That's the worst part about it, chat. I know I can go get Golden Veil. Or Flame give me strength, and it would take like 20% less time. But I don't want to. You know what's never helped anyone ever get through over get through anything? It's telling them to take a break. Chat pro tip. It's never been helpful advice ever. Never ever. Not saying taking breaks can't be helpful, but telling someone to take a break is never helpful. I swear, man. You miss one, and then your confidence and your timing is just shattered.
a parry attack, please. Manza, thank you for the A-bump. Literally, like, a fucking, could you ever do an attack that I can parry? Thank you. God damn. It's so infuriating. This is all she ever fucking does, dude. Oh my god, I'm out of fucking mana. Of a fucking course I am, dude. Fuck off. Oh my fucking god, dude. Literally, I mean, the last fucking quarter of her health took as long as the entire rest of her fucking health bar. Like, what the fuck? Her AI is like a fucking design to just stop using the parable moves. I swear to God. What the fuck, man? What the fuck?
animals. Trick me the animal in you. Thought I wouldn't notice the mana situation, did ya? Thought you were being real sneaky, huh, Melania? I fucking hate that move. Fucking missed it. And now it's gonna take an entire fucking other one. Yep, cause she heals. Now I gotta do two fucking repose for her to be fucking zero HP again. Ha 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 ha. Great boss. You can't push her to phase two from a repose, so I have to do a guard counter. And if she's anything else but literally zero HP, when I block an attack to do the guard counter, she will recover too much HP to die to the guard counter. Begging you. Just do it. Do the move. Do it. Come on! Okay, she, she's clearly not fucking interested in doing it. Chat. You can't say I didn't fucking try. I don't have a carrying retaliation anymore. I switched to the gold parry. Oh boy. 
This is going to end poorly. She's gonna do the move now, isn't she? Fuck you. You know, rumor has it she can do parry bill attacks and fists too. There you go. Gonna have to disagree with you on that one again. Broken. Let your flesh be consumed. So fucking stupid. Hunt. Could she ever fucking do a parry attack? Just literally ever. Literally ever. It puts you so on edge, man. The game's gonna crash. This is an infinite load screen. You just go two fucking minutes without a fucking parryable attack. You lose all sense of rhythm. And then she finally does one and you miss it and she instantaneously fucking kills you. Oh, God. I launched the wrong version of the game. Thank you, Fang. I'm 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 losing my mind a little bit at this point. I apologize for the gamer rage. God, I fucking suck at that one. I fucking suck at that one.
Lord of Port editor. I'm sorry, Max. Hope you find it in your heart to forgive me. <laughs> Not the Fortnite dailies, Rads. You better get on it. Bro, that one is so horseshit. I swear to God, the parry window is just fucking wrong on it. It's just wrong. It's always that one. It's always that one, man. And save me. I've been fighting Melania for five hours. That's a lot. It's like four and a half. Maybe three and a half. I don't know. Does anyone know? Does time mean anything anymore? Chad, thank you for the two months. Oh, no.
Always, always, always that one. What do you mean that wasn't a parry? My fucking ass, bro. What do you mean? And then you just die. And then you just die in one hit. Aggie, put on armor. No. I don't want to, because I'm fucking stupid. You've heard normal buckler parry has less startup frames than golden parry. You've heard wrong. I assure you that I have considered looking into these things before fighting Melania for five hours. No, Melania, no! That's not fair! Oh, can I menu? you? Holy shit. What am I looking for here? <laughs> what, what am I looking for? I've got a vision. I need to figure out how to execute it. None, none of these are working. I need a big red clown nose. It's 
clearly what I am for doing this. But how do I get a fucking... I don't know if it's possible. Can I get blush at least? Where's my where's my blush? There we go. And then This, this is just not what I was looking for. That's really not. How do they not just... I, I just want a circle, man. Just give me a circle. How big can I make this? It'll do. Back to Joker. Okay. I can't do anything right. Why did she... She wasn't even fucking aiming at me. She, she just fucking dead angled me. Coder taking the block. Nifty taking the two months. Tets. 
soothing to the brunt. But wait, there's more. That's not all, folks. No, 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 hold on. You gotta hit her one more time. Actually, wait, no, I decided we weren't doing this anymore because it's fucking horseshit because she refuses to cooperate. All right, hold up. Hold up. Fuck you. That was the period right there. Bitch, what the fuck is you aiming at? I roll. So glad to have made zero progress. No, let's let's do this attack again. Great idea, Melania. Everyone loves this one. It's so much fun.
fuck, there, there is my one fucking opportunity for a parry for the next 10 minutes. Shit. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm fucking dead. By the scarlet rot. Oh my god. If by a single one of them, you're just fucked. It's it's fucking ridiculous, man. It's fucking ridiculous. It's not even that I can't dodge the moves. It's the fact that I get a parryable move every five fucking minutes in phase two. It takes so long that inevitably you just get squeezed into a wall during that attack and then you die. Bullshit. Bullshit. Blade of Nicola. Ah. 
Oh, the pain. Yeah, right, man. See you, Blaze. PRX wins balloon. Thank you for the ten gifted. I am Melania. Very kind of you. Blade of Mikola. Ten gifties. I gotta get this soon, chat. Like I can't, I can't, I can't be up. I can't be up when when my wife wakes up for work. <laughs> At least I can't be streaming. Gotta get this within the next half hour. I wish I could just skip to phase two, man. Chat, if I did this run like three days earlier, before the latest hotfix came out, we'd be done. We would have been done hours ago. They literally just fixed this bitch. <sighs> Before the latest patch, if you were posted her to kill her in phase one, she just died. <laughs> 
she just would not have a phase two. <laughs> Which would be lame, yes. But she would be dead. <laughs> Hollow victory for sure. They patched it by now making it impossible to send her to phase two via repost. So that's that's really cool. I yeah, I, I have to do the spell parry thing. Or do a guard counter, but considering she heals every time you block, that one doesn't work out too well. I fucking love that emote, Kojin. It's so good. The Bogdanov, bro. To be fair, Potterhead, the original plan was to not include Melania, but then I realized we've got to include Melania. Let me equip it, please. I hate that it, it, it like, trolls you by not letting you equip it if you don't have the stats. Okay. Okay.
parry that dude. Come on. What the fuck? I've made zero progress. How's that not a parry?
Okay, two more. One more. She's dead. Jesus. Oh, dear Mikola. Oh, my dear God. My brother. I'm sorry. I finally met my match. Oh. Oh, God. That's got to be the hardest boss kill I've ever done. In, in anything. Holy shit. Whitey's kid in the room, thank you for the four months. Sola kid, thank you for the sub. Boxer, thanks for the thousand minutes. Sidney, thank you for the 300. Potterhead, thanks for the 3000. Okay. Okay. Berlin, thank you for the sub. Artemis, thank you for the 300 bits. I'm gonna hang on to these remembrances, actually. Let me make this carry in retaliation. Furry, thank you for the 400 bits. Skeptical Sports, thank you for the five gifted. Okid, thank you for the gift. Subby. Okay. All right, what are we getting? Yeah, that seems that seems reasonable. Actually, I might need mind for Elden Beast because Elden Beast has a million HP. Yeah, you know what? Radagon's gonna be simple. It's really just Elden Beast. I don't I don't need to worry about damage for Radagon. I don't think. I just need to worry about having enough mind for fucking Elden Beast. I think we're gonna have to retaliate, spam him. 
with something. It's not going to do very much damage because they ruined carrying retaliation, and he's 80% resistant to holy damage, so golden retaliation is not going to be a good time. Yeah, you know, fuck the vigor as well. Just give me more mind. I'm going to hold on to the remembrances till after I uh, get a feel for what we're up against in the final boss, and then we'll apply those points accordingly. Yeah, okay. How much do I need for a level 69k? Yeah, we'll just wait. All right. Let's do it. The end is near. There's, there's no way it's as hard as Melania. I think Radagon's gonna be a cakewalk. I'm a little worried about Elden Beast, just because there's no good way for me to parry or guard counter him. Grab baloney. Okay, right again. That was a little cheap. A little cheap, but. Okay. Not an amazing first attempt, but not bad. I gotta figure out what all the moves are parryable on him. Wasn't bad. It's a relative cakewalk. Just because we didn't first try him doesn't mean he's not going to be easy. Comparatively. That's the keyword chat. Comparatively easy. He keeps getting me with this. Oh, rascal? Stop it. Time. Dude, I keep thinking he's doing this fucking long one. Cut it out, man. It's rude. Okay. Mm -hmm. No, 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 no. No one grabs me five times in a row. That, that was an experiment. I didn't expect that to be very able to. It was, it was worth trying.
Cut it out, man. Stop it. Now the fast crab isn't new. Just getting destroyed by it. Mid-fight menuing is not going to work out as well here, huh? He, he has significantly less chill than Millennium. Melania, his daughter? It's a bitch daughter, dude. You should have raised her better, bro. It is literally the law of the universe that as soon as I put on the full health damage bonus talisman, I take damage. I don't know why I keep bothering. Hello. <laughs> no, stop it. I hate you. The worst movement. Come on, man. We're so close. Oh, I'm very tired, it's true. Very tired indeed.
high score. I think. He really does not like doing variable attacks after the, uh, the initial start, huh? There we go. <laughs> if you roll back when he starts that, you're just getting hit by. It's my worst nightmare. Okay. Uh, no! Stop! I'm alive! I'm not alive. What a ridiculous move. I need I need I need to I need to fucking learn to recognize it. Nice buffered fucking L2. Yep. Mm hmm. I, I definitely want to do one right then. Mm hmm. Yep. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Not this shit. Not this shit again. You know, that's fine. I'm close enough to full health. Both of those two.
Come on. Bro, fuck that attack. I have no idea how you're supposed to dodge that combo. Stop stalling. Okay. What the, what do you do there? What do you want from me, game? See what Elden Beast is all about. Gone down. Okay. I don't really know what to expect out of Elden Beast, I'll be honest. So you can't parry him, so th that's that's out. Uh, guard breaking or guard countering him doesn't really work either because he only has a few melee attacks. Oh god, I'm fat rolling. That's, that's a problem. Alright, there we go. So, I think we're left to retaliate spam. Oh god. Shit, if I could even get my shit set up. So, gold retaliation's holy damage, and Elden Beast is like super mega resistant to holy damage. 
So let's see how bad this is. It's gonna be bad. I'll tell you that right now. I don't even know when to hit him, really. Ow. Right now, go. Oh, God. Alright, whatever. It's 36 damage. Okay, so you can't lock on. 186. Yup. That's, uh, that's without the charm. I forgot the charm. Let's try carrying retaliation. Maybe it's better. I, I doubt it will be. If this was the previous patch, carrying retaliation would be for sure better, but they ruined it. In the latest patch. Okay, it's better. It's better. It's better. 3 3 3. It's a viable amount. It's also a lot easier to hit. This is viable. I need more FP though. I don't, I don't think I have enough. I definitely don't have enough. I need to put on my bug. Do I just suicide now since I obviously don't have enough mana? Oops. I think I suicide now. Alright, 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 alright. Go ahead and reset. Now we know, chat. Now we know. We have a bunch of remembrances in our back pockets that we can pop to level up our FP. Um, let's see. We can switch our physic to be magic damage. That will help. Allocate... Let's go with 6 FP, sure. Is there a magic scorpion? Does a magic scorpion exist? Celibus quest reward. Bro, fucking Celibus. Alexander Talisman. Now there's something that would be helpful. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Okay. Okay. So we need to get the Warrior Jar Shard. Which means we have to beat Radon. And we probably should get the Magic Scorpion. So we gotta do Celibus' quest. Oh boy. If we if we want to uh to go in as prepared as possible, we could try to brute force it right now. We could try to brute force it. Is there any other magic boosting gear? Uh, 
Rogers. You're right. Oh, but my Fia drip. Not my Fia drip. We've been through so much. You know what? We got through Melania with it. That's that's done its due. Okay, so Roger's outfit here. Every piece of it gives two percent uh, Glintstone magic damage boost. Let me say that again. Every piece of it gives Glintstone magic weapon skills a 2% damage boost. So for the whole set, it's 8% damage, which is significant. It's definitely significant. Also, it's drippy as hell. Okay. If we sell all of those. We can get a few more levels. Two, two more levels. Wow, two more fucking levels. That's great. Intelligence would make the damage a little better. Emphasis on a little bit. Mm-hmm. Do I put it in mind or do I put it in int? Hmm. I'm gonna put it in int. Okay. We're gonna hail Mary this for like one more go at Elden Beast, and if it doesn't work out, then we're gonna have to do another stream. Yet another stream. But we'll give it one more shot for now. Okay. Mm So the problem is I can't kill Alex where he is right now because he's at the festival. You can't kill him when he's at the festival. And the only way to end the festival is to kill Radon. Shit, he clapped me. Okay, I need to put on my better clothes. Okay, full armor.
Dude, the parry timings on Radagon make so much more sense than Millennium. This is so nice. So nice. I'm having a blast. Yup. I'm having a blast. getting there. Chat, I know this is maybe a strange time to be acknowledging this, but... Radicon is kind of daddy? Anyone, anyone else feel this? This man's kind of hot. I mean, that's not my personal preference, but, you know, I can recognize. <laughs> Just thought I'd throw it out there. Oh, God. Okay. Back to Elden Beast. Last, last attempt for the night. If this doesn't work out, when uh, it doesn't work out, we'll, we'll do another stream. Four seventy seven ain't bad. Oh. Four thirty two ain't bad either.
Do I have the mana for this? What, what the fuck? Okay, that's not my fault. It was 44 damage. Whatever, man. He just, he just booped his little head right into it. I don't know if we have the mana. I don't think the pace is good. I don't think the pace is good at all. Yeah, we're bound. That's unfortunate. Stop doing this. Movie. It's actually fucking me over. It's normally easy to dodge but when you're trying to set up a stupid bell thing. Kind of a bitch. gonna get him like halfway ish dead and then we're out of FP need to bring in more flasks or do more damage Dude, we're so close. We're so close, but we're out of time. So, so close. Man. All right, well. We finish tomorrow, I suppose. 
<sighs> We're gonna get it done, chat. We're gonna get it done. This run has become such a monster. So much more trouble than I was expecting, my god. But, we'll get it done tomorrow. Until then, take care.